hey and you're 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 good milkman like you're it's well that's a convenient uh your name is now milkman milk your name is now milkman you're you're good dude uh like i appre i appreciate even lurking those who are lurking out there i even appreciate that i ain't fucked up your name's just now milkman I dispense the milk from my nipples. I mean... So I, w I do want to I do want to point out something that I've been de uh, dealing with when it comes to problems and uh, streaming, and it's mainly been me trying to get uh, audio. See, like you you guys hearing the music, we can't hear. I can't hear that on my end. So like I haven't set to monitor, but it's not monitor, and I don't know why. Stream died for a second there. Oh, it's because monitoring is off. And it, okay, is is stream is is stream buffering a lot right now? I think it's just buffering a bunch on my end. Okay. Where have you been for the past 15 years? That's been a thing. Uh, that that's hold up. That's happening on stream. You no, we're ha we're we're having this conversation on stream. All right. So, hello everybody. I am going to give a, a little hello now that we're mostly set up. But uh according to L Alana Cat here, her first response to opening a pop tart package is when when the fuck did it come with four packs of pop tarts? Are you my my? Yeah, you're you're unmuted. If y'all if y'all can hear me, as far as back as I can, as far back as I can remember eating pop tarts in my life, there's only been three packs of pop tarts in a box of pop tarts, not four. I don't ever remember there being four. There's correct been, me if I'm wrong. I, I I could be wrong. There's been four for the past fifteen years. Nobody asked you to correct me. I want them to correct. me. Wow. <laughs> I just don't remember there being more than three. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. It's, all, it's, it's always been four. See? See? Okay. Oh. Thank you, Nexus. And not Lockwood. Ugh, microwave. Yeah, it's not that bad. Maybe not three seconds, but it's not that bad. I think you've had me microwave your pop tarts before, and they've been fine. Yeah. But it's it's a box of pop tarts. 
It's usually only had three as far as I can, unless my parents always bought like the cheap ass box that's only got three in it. Yeah, there's a store brand version that does have three, I do recall that, but never the like actual <sighs> name brand Pop-Tarts. Yes, Pop-Tarts, Coaster Pastry. Ah, uh, I apologize. No, they're... Far back, uh, I just... My parents just always bought the three packs. I wonder if you could get like a like a smaller box of the name brand and like a three pack it's like a buck cheaper or something also as a bit of a heads up i got a sore in the back like far back of my mouth where my jaw is so talking and moving my cheeks a certain way is gonna hurt so if i botch some voices that's why salt water remember oh yeah i should probably do some salt water shouldn't i well uh do we have salt here uh no i put my lunchbox downstairs oh then well, I'll not worry about it. I'll do it after stream. Oh, all right. Okay, but yeah, uh, let's go ahead and kick shit off here. Uh, it's been a fascinating morning for me, and I apologize if I feel like I lack a little bit of energy today. It's... Yeah. Okay, that should... I didn't want to put. Oh, lovely. Okay. You're grumpy today. Oh, gross. I don't know why. I don't know. Oh, I think it needs to stop then. I'm not the one doing it. I just think it's right in here. She's speaking, or somebody's speaking. No, oh, that's. Oh. You must have always skipped the intro because I don't remember this. Either yeah. that or I'm never here for the intro. You weren't here for the intro when I <laughs> ran it. Okay, so. Uh, everything is good. So, should be able to transition right over. And uh, UK may actually have. Uh, well, UK, the, the island area, not UK, but. Uh, that part of UK, Ireland, and whatnot may have, uh, may have that just under a different name. Okay, so. It's audio coming through just fine. I'm seeing it on my end. I don't know if it's coming through on stream because some things did have to get a little goofy bopped. Let's see. Uh, I'm going to just go to my stream channel. There we go. Is it playing? Hold on. Okay, yeah, everything's going. Okay. So, where we last left off was we discovered that, uh... God, what, what's his name? It starts with the V. I, I am, I am having a day. Uh... We, we, we figured out uh, Virgilio. We found out that Virgilio uh, more or less was an absolute fucking badass. And I think that's, uh, yeah. Oh, no. So uh, for the title, for a little bit of extra context, there's a lot of people on TikTok right now that are faking actual disabilities with uh, to get like views and clout and shit. Uh, there is one person that I saw as an example. They didn't show their name because, you know, can't trust the internet to not harass people. But, uh, there was somebody who faked having Tourette's 
for uh, views on TikTok, and that's not okay. Kind of like that one person that was faking getting kidnapped on YouTube. Yeah. Making videos of her getting kidnapped. Which is weird. How do you make a video on that and people believe it? I mean, like, why would you? This doesn't make sense. No, just flat on, flat out, like faking it. Uh, Monica cat, uh, Neko. So, whoop, whoop. Neko, that's that lucky cat thing, right? Yeah. Okay, perfect. <laughs> and I, I'm starting to reach reach that point as well, honestly. Let's see. I mean, uh, <laughs> I bet that's what's going on. Oh boy, game with, you know. With, with this this little title right here with the extra context that I have <laughs> it, it uh <laughs> the final remaster no no it's, no it's not worth it woman marries anime pillow I let's, like that let's one. read that one that one seems more fun <laughs> I think that's what the corona is supposed to be was nature going you guys need to go I remember a time when a, when wacky stuff like this made a lot of headlines. But even re, even though I'm reporting on it, I can't help but think how mundane it's become. I mean, we live in a world where you can just plug into the internet and live there for as long as your wallet can afford related feeds. Lots of people get married in these. Yes, I am stuttering right now. That that was me just being weird. Uh, married in these virtual spaces, thanks uh, thanks to new technology. Uh, to, yeah, to new technologies, the traditional views on human relationships have changed so much that someone marrying a little object feels kind of tame now. If the pillow had some form of intelligence, it, m it might be somewhat different, but it but it's just a plain generic anime hug pillow. Get with the times, Grandma. No, I'm not. I actually did have a moment where my brain was just like, hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay, you're good. You guys should have heard me when I was trying to ask Lockwood something over the, the Google Hub. And I was like, what was I trying to remember? I can't even remember what the word was I was trying to remember. But I kept going, oh, I wanted the pot holder. And I, and I, Google will, if you pause for too long, the Google Hub will uh, stop listening to you and send what you're what you've already said and so i was tr i was saying the 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 trying to get the hub to stay listening to me long enough to remember that i wanted the pot holder but it sent like halfway through anyways and then i had to scream at it because it does that a lot uh but yeah let's i think we got everything good to go so <laughs> when i'm married <laughs> The cat wanted to be married. <laughs> I think it's cute that Jill <coughs> for her son. Anyways, let's kick this off. Good evening. Ah, Jill! I'm out, of, I'm out to get firecrackers! I'm gonna get the big ones that blow up stuff so we can stick it in things and make it go boom. That <laughs> sounds like her too. Firecrackers? It's New Year's, right? We need some! Wouldn't firecracker scare off the do- Yeah, you know what? Good idea. Go ahead. The dogs. I'll be back in a bit with ones that blow up extra hard. Ah. <laughs> Even for a cat lover, you uh, sure get excited about firecrackers a whole lot more when dogs are involved. You know, I know how hypocritical it sounds, but I don't care. Ah, Jamie's here. Great. Where'd he go? <clears throat> Play that fucking uh, Earthbound mystery uh, sound. He's gone. Well, he likes to hang out with um, Jill anyways, right? Yep. Anyways, let's start. Let's see, what can I do this time? <laughs> I 
No. That will be done on like joking endings. You really like that song, don't you? And that, that's at this point, I feel like it's become a meme. Let's see. Uh, there we go. Go. Time to mix drinks and change lives. Ah! ah, the guy who wouldn't come back twice. Yeah, yeah. Oh, hey, you. Yeah, yeah. Shut up. By any chance, did you, uh, did something fly over here two weeks ago? On Friday? You know, I don't obligate people to do that but if you want to do it just like literally you can you can genuinely just tell me like from a video game and i will do my best to look something up or i'll just do like a dumb cop out improv line whichever seems to come to my brain first but yeah on friday yeah there were lots of weird ex <clears throat> There were lots of weird explosion noises throughout the night. But as far as I understand, those were made by a flying drone uh, by a flying drone or something like that. So it flew by here. I take it you know who made that noise. Let's just keep it uh, whatever drone story you heard. That was a weird accent. Kitty Uh Right. <laughs> that always got annoying after a while, I must say. So it remained in the vicinity. I don't know what counts as in the vicinity, but yeah, it's about your shot. Distant explosions all night. Well, I'm like, are you sure you want me to add you to the title with you yawning? I wasn't yawning until I started drinking the energy. Interesting. So, it didn't get far away. Huh. Um. Uh, now get me a Marsh Blast. Okay. Funny. See, can I do double on this one? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Up, oh, hold up. Reset. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Roger Clots. Now, see, now that you, now that you said that, Nexus. Hold on, we'll see. No, I absolutely cannot. Yay! Six, uh, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 20, 20. Yeah, no. So we're just gonna do a normal ass. Six. One. One, two, three, four, Yeah, I think my parents had the same issue. What? Yeah, like uh, Roger Klotz saying socks. So did a bad word for a long time. Okay. Darn heck sucks. It's all precursor to learning bad words. Alrighty then. Let's see, uh, blended. So I'm just gonna let that sucker run. Oh, okay, 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 And off it goes. Like I wasn't even allowed to say hella. I mean, my parents didn't allow me to say hella, but 
They didn't care that I said sucks. They were just like, yeah, whatever, fuck it. Well, you didn't mess up. Oh, shit. Sorry if I may interject. <laughs> you looking for a fight? Most certainly not. Pick a fight with Jamie. That man looks like You know, that, that's that's kind of a valid point there. I apologize if I'm not totally intensive. I am wanting so that energy drink is not making sex. Trying not to do this. Okay. Yeah, you're doing fine. Uh, I'll probably be munching uh, on a break point. Most certainly not. You really think you stand a chance? You're like half a size. I can fight dirty. He kills people for a living. Poor Jamie. He looks so sweet right now, and I don't know why. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. I didn't ask face. for this. <laughs> <laughs> I can fight dirty. Jill, you, please, you make me sound like a savage. It would be like me saying that you get people drunk for a living. <laughs> I don't mean it's not a lot. It's not wrong, but there are better ways of saying stuff like that. You're right. Sorry, but also, yeah, technically you're also right that I do get dr people drunk for a living. And like I said, I'm not looking for a fight. I just noticed you seem to like strong drinks. What about it? Well, to be honest, it's a rare sight in this bar. I even come to believe I'm the only one here who enjoys them, aside from the owner. C-word, is that candy? I like candy. Car? Computer? I'm gonna clear my Discord status. Is it Good car? Trees. Is it computer? Cord. Is it computation? It's like your brain. That's the joke. <laughs> may I suggest? May I suggest you try a suplex next time? It might be to your leg. Hmm. Okay, let's try this suplex thing. These people drink, like, they're drinking. Right! What the suplex?! No, I, I believe uh, I, I said Asphodel was from the U the uh, island. It was like the uh, like England, Ireland, and all that. Uh, I don't know what to call those isl that island set specifically without sounding like an asshole. The Isles. There we go. That that's actually perfect. I kind of like that. It's, it's great. Too. Okay, so this can be doubled down. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Yeah, because like uh, one of the biggest things about like that whole set of area is it, it's just not one big ass island. And I didn't I didn't know what to call it. Now now I do, and that and I appreciate that. Three, one, two, three. No, 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 I goofed. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, 
next day. Two, three, one, two, three. I'm not making very accurate strokes. Two, three, one, two, three. I'm like trying to do crab circle, crab circle, crab circle, and I'm. Ugh. Okay, that's. Uh, rocks and mix. And done. Here. Huh, good stuff. Like a less burning but punchier pile driver. Pa 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 pa. Them peas in there. Sudbury. Huh? I bet that sounds weird. Without an act. Sounds like I'm saying something about soap. Yeah, or but, but, yeah, but it's also usually called the British Isles, but like there's there's land there that isn't British. <laughs> I think it all depends on what part of the islands that you're on when you're calling it. I mean, I'm, I'm content with just calling it the Isles because that's just all of them in general. Yeah, that's that that whole setup there is just call it the Isles and it works perfectly. Anyways, and say your face looks some uh, looks somehow familiar, Mister. Call me Jamie, and you are. I'm Ingram. Anyway, I think I saw your face somewhere. Maybe when I needed to look for a specific file at. Mm, did you perhaps go through na a nano machine? <laughs> nano machine expunge. No, I did actually. I figured as much. Only a handful of people do that. Oh, oh that's Van. Should be Van. Also, the, also, uh, as uh, totally just remember this. Th uh, those who are in the like the Gulf Coast area of America right now, like, buckle down. And I hope you guys come out well, because there's a tropical depression coming through that's going to be causing some issues. Another type of depression we don't need. No, this is seasonal, so... Uh. I'd rather it be seasonal than, like, actual global warming adjacent. You missed the joke, but it's okay. Just everybody stay safe, okay? You know, yeah. Do good things. So. But yeah. Almost all of them are people with nano machine rejection that, that feels oddly suicidal. <laughs> throat, my throat was all fucky. So why go through the whole thing? Rejection? Need need something to hide? The second. It's easier to remain undetected when they have no means to track you or your activity. Ah, I see. How does the expunge work? You lie in the pressure chamber and they give you a uh, special IV solution. It causes it, it causes nano machine uh, rejection while giving you the antibodies needed to prevent them from getting back in. For five hours, you're trapped in a bed while a horrible pressure builds up in, on in your body. <laughs> Stumbling over my tongue! When nano machines are forced out, they're like little needles all over your body. You feel them in your eyes, in your gums, in your toes, everywhere. After all that, they need to implant you with a mechanism that's, that constantly releases the same antibodies. Ouch. What are you having, Jamie? This is a gut punch. Yeah. Should've figured. Give me one of those. Oh. Sure. Looks like, um, uh, Ingram and Jamie are friends now. Right? Uh, so that can be 10, 12, 
Yeah, maybe double down. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Planet Geeds. Two karma trains can make it strong. Aged and mixed. Boom. Yeah, it's. I've been seeing a lot of that, like in the uh, in the art space for memes, and I'm just kind of like, yeah. Quite upsetting. It's, it's, it's not a crouching position. That's it, just a, well, what's yes, it's the air. What's even worse is uh, it's putting on ex uh, display who doesn't know how anatomy works. Right. And I've been seeing a lot of people uh, drawing things in places that they shouldn't be. And it's certainly been fascinating. Lady bits don't front like that. That's pretty much what's going on. <laughs> you know, you'd think that people would learn by now, at least. I mean, if you can't, if you don't have full access, watch some porn or something to get an idea. I've something actually like had somebody <laughs> try to defend it. Uh, how they were doing it as legit and tried to pass it off as me not knowing you know how the body works right it doesn't <laughs> and yeah yeah and also to be able to push your rear up that high and still be able to balance yourself you'd have to have like no breasts whatsoever I mean, Jacko kind of doesn't, but yeah. Oh, All right, so there's something wrong uh, with not having breath. Sorry, that was sir. rude. I just the the position that she was in. Very uncomfortable. <laughs> Anyways, here. Yeah, I love these. It looks different from here, so. I added a couple extras in his actually. <laughs> so where's the antibody unit? unit they stuck you in, or stuck you with, ja uh, Jamie. Inside, like all other maintenance systems. Also, yeah, Jacko is definitely not human. Oh. Yeah. Though it is, though it is funny that to have characters, like, in Guilty Gear think that she's human, because that just makes it really funny. I guess okay so uh, I guess that if you pretend if you say that she's not human you can just say well that's just how she's built and she's able to be shaped like that when crouching yeah it's the same thing with how I do do with Naya she shouldn't t typically she shouldn't be able to have the range of mobility that she does with her uh features and she does because I actually have it on paper that she has just a completely different skeletal structural uh, structure as well. Well that and she can change her shape of well anyway. So for her size. And also that's a valid point because Jacko has a lot of other things about her that is actually really cool that people don't even know. But yeah, uh it can be troublesome at times, but the perks of not having nanomachines in the body outweighs the cons. Gotta adjust my volume on the side. It's really loud. I was actually about to ask you the same thing. Yeah, no, if it's too loud for you. I have asked you that. You've told me that you can't turn mine down separately from yours, so. Yeah, because it's, it's on the same uh, line. Like, if you want to turn down, I don't mind. Okay. But it's down to a good point now. Yeah, I can, I can handle. It. And the rest of the enhancements. Uh, I'm starting to make him sound like a weird detective guy. He is starting to sound like that actually. On his own. You reconstructed, uh, or were, were you reconstructed, or ha have you been adding them over time? There we go. That's a. That's an art site, Pixiv. Uh, that makes sense. Pixel. Okay. Over time, either by <clears throat> either by getting much needed enhance uh, a much needed enhancement, or through fixing in uh, through fixing injuries. 
I see. Well, it was a pleasure, Jamie, but I gotta leave. Nice meeting you, Manigrim. Please come again. Don't count on it. I like that. He says don't count on it. He's gonna be back. You said that <laughs> twice now. Shut up. Seemed like a nice guy. Right. I won't call him a bastard, but he's not the nicest and nicest in the bunch. Maybe you caught him on a bad day. Nah, I think you're just good at uh, bringing out the nicer side of people. Oddly enough. That is true, actually. Ugh, that guy tires the hell out of me. <laughs> I can't do your voice. There we go. <laughs> He's just gonna scream off into the distance. Yeah, I think I got like a canker sore like right where my gum and my cheek uh meet. Causing oh, pain. You getting the salt water? Yeah. Like a couple of teaspoons. I'm sorry. What? Uh, so aside from things that I literally can't mention on Twitch because it would get me in trouble, uh, she just has really high flexibility and uh, a certain bones on her have high, uh, a certain bone structure areas have higher elasticity when they're not supposed to mainly in the chest and neck area. If you like two and two together on that one. I actually don't have the uh, physiology post done yet because there's a couple of things I'm trying to uh, hash out that makes sense in my head that also covers most of my bases. It's not something that I normally have in artwork. Let's bear with me a moment here. Okay, sorry about that. But yeah, someone's in a good mood. Give me a bad touch, will you? That way you'll be in a good mood too. <laughs> a bad touch for Alma! Give her, I'm gonna give her a bad, a bad touch. I'm gonna give her a bad touch. Bad touch! Let's see. Four Bronsons. Four Powder Deltas. Four flanner geeds. An eight karma trees. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Oh my 
Crystal Rocks. We're nothing but mammals after all. Land touch! Here. Jill, you have such a petty sense of humor. Guilty as charged. So, what put you in a good mood? Oh, yeah, that. Today my sister was supposed to be in court for all the uh, for all the cus custody custard proceedings. Also, quick BRB one more time. Oh, wow, that came back to a good fucking song. Listen to this shit. I know, this is actually not bad. Yeah, fuck yeah. Let's fucking go. Today my sister uh, uh, was supposed yeah, was supposed to be in court for all the custard proceedings. 
Of course, not only does she not uh, does she show up later than uh, show up later than her husband and drunk at that, but also dressed like she got fucked in the back of the parking lot. Oh dear, oh my. Also, for those who are probably seeing uh, seeing that I'm being a lot better about my B or B uh, status, I actually adjusted my uh, Elgato Stream Deck to be red uh, the button to be red when it's active when it's not supposed to be active so there's a lot of things that like i can now just glance at and be like oh yeah that shouldn't be on i'm sinking again oh, i need a new chair <laughs> should, should i should i prepare the seatbelt as you as you go down ding ding no ding. you can <laughs> you can have my chair since you want a new one this and chair is not gonna support you this chair is no, trash no, 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 no. i'm gonna get a new new chair that can support me because yeah i'm serious this this thing lied in the weight it holds yeah because it said it unless i'm over oh anyways uh, uh and and to top it off she even for, uh she forgot to even bring her kids uh, luckily my parents brought them to court the judge assigned me the kids to, or assigned the kids to my parents for the time being so she really messed it up huh when they came back to the uh, when they came back to the house and De uh, Diana started throwing a temper tantrum she said it was lucky uh, it, yeah it was lucky her husband didn't get the kids because the angst would make her jump into the highway uh I'm mainly minding Twitch's terms of service there to the best of our abilities, even though we kind of step over that line pretty frequently. I mean, I can mention my weight, can't well, I? W when it... Yeah, I mean, you can. I just... I don't because... I don't know why I don't. Yeah. This, the, okay, we'll just go with this. The chair says it holds 350. But when I sit in it, it sinks. Well, it probably doesn't actually support 350. It might be... 350 up to the chair's weight plus mine. Well, 350 on the piston when it's fully uh, depressed. As in all the way down, yes. then it'll hold 350? Because that, that's, that's the same with this one. Uh, I actually looked up the uh, the weight limit for this chair, and it's when uh, the piston can support it when it's all the way down. When it's up, it scales the weight uh, downward. So it's supposed to do that. Yeah. I don't like sinking with my knees up to my chest. It's dumb. It's absolutely dumb. It actually puts pain into my toes and they start getting- Also numb. also face the mic, please. You're like oh, I'm doing sorry. a lot of this. My, it my, sounds like you're distant. <laughs> my toes go numb when my my, my it, it just cuts off circulation. By the right? way, I'm probably I'm probably just gonna buy uh I not non-mounted <laughs> mic stands at this point. Oh. Alright. Because like we it, both you and Raven Joe I, just do this with the mic all the time. Uh, I'm just, I'm always afraid that I'm eating the mic. No, fucking, I, I, I have it set so you can be this close to the mic. Okay. You're supposed, like, this mic, you're supposed to be close. It really is false advertising. And yes, it absolutely because is. Because when a chair says it holds up to 350 pounds while I'm... It's a whole fucking It's not yeah. even facing you. It's oh, like... that explains it. I thought I had pulled it down so that it would face me. But I'm always afraid I'm going to break shit. Oh. oh, whoa. Oh, yeah, but then, yeah, okay. I mean, you don't need that. You're usually pretty good about that. Well, I don't, I don't. Okay, yeah. When, when he does it, now he's, I can't see the... he's just like, <laughs> into the microphone. But it just, I, I can't see anything with this in, in front of it, so maybe I can. Yeah, put it to the side. If you, if, you feel like you, uh, uh, if you feel like you don't need it, you don't need it. Okay, am I coming out clearly? Wow, I can even hear myself talk now. Yeah, see, I, I have it. Okay. <clears throat> I have it set to be where you can practically like be up against I'm the right, mic, and you will still be fine. Okay. Well, I just it really bothers me because I really want a chair that can actually hold me up and not down onto the floor with my knees up. I, it's 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 very uncomfortable. And it, it makes me not want to gain more. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to continue on here. Okay. Because I do believe we're actually approaching closer to the end of the game at this point. Oh, no. Oh, that's a good thing. What are we playing next? Uh, I might do like some quick one-off games uh, for a while. Because this day is going to be very tentative for a, for a bit. 
I'm kind of what sorry one last thing I'm really sad I went on um uh steam and looked up uh the whisker squadron and they're not set to come out till next year yeah no uh we got like a tech demo that's it oh and uh, that welcome to video games they want to make sure uh beam i think it's beam fly they want to make sure that the game's like good enough to snub <sighs> anyways then make sure it kills you because we aren't dealing with you as a cripple cripple I shouldn't reinforce that behavior, but <laughs> I, I, I felt that compensation kick in, and that was am that was amazing. <laughs> uh, was Passion Lip around when we did the um, Whisker Squadron? I don't think so. If they were, they were lurking. I don't. For for the record, I don't have a. Uh, members in chat up because I try not to obsess over numbers. Oh, yeah. I really, really, really enjoyed doing the voices for those cats. That was so much fun. But yeah. I don't know. Maybe it was the timing, but I've been laughing for an hour now. <gasps> you hold quite the anim... anim animosity. Ooh. You hold quite the animosity for Diana, don't you? That's fine. Lurking's fine. Yeah, I appreciate lurking. Lurking's good. It still shows as a view, and that's yep. What counts? That pleases the algorithm gods. <laughs> she and I used to be the closest friends uh, when I was uh, seven or eight. We played all the time. We uh, we played all the time. We even slept on the same bed for a while. And then she just uh, turned into a teen. We stopped playing. She had other things she wanted to do. I can forgive all of that. I mean, the age difference and all. But there is something in particular I can't forgive. It was a day she invited her friends to the house, and I went to ask her uh, ask her something. As I was leaving, one of her friends asked if I was her sister, and she said she had no little sisters. Oh, what a bitch! Ouch. I think that was the moment that I, that finally uh, broke the pedestal I held her on. I admire her so much as a kid. Uh, uh, as uh, yeah, I admire her as much as a kid. Uh, uh, I admired her. Do you know? Little by little, that admiration wore off until we finally reached that breaking point. I felt betrayed. And you haven't been able to figure out, uh, or haven't been able to. And you haven't been able to forgive her for, uh, after 40 years. 40, goddamn. Hey. She's that old? It's not that I still hold a grudge against her, but rather... The Diana who said all those things so, uh, so many years ago is the same Diana I know today. How so? She hasn't matured one bit. <laughs> She's still as selfish, childish, and immature as she was back then. When you see her, you don't see an, an adult. You see an overgrown, horny teen. So aside from destroying any admiration I held for her, she's made sure not to fix the impression. Huh. But enough about me. Let's get... How are you? I was, I was gonna go into a uh, food fight quote, but I stopped myself because I was like, that would be really dumb. Food fight. It's a really, 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 really fucked. Like, the movie is fucked in a way that's not like, oh, that's a fucked up subject. It's fucked in a way productionally. Oh. Yeah. The biggest one. Oh, yeah. The ahoge. It's the uh, little the hair thing. Like, it, a food fight more or less started up as like a massive uh, celebrity, like all the big names were involved. Yeah. Charlie Sheen, uh, Wayne Brady, uh, the <laughs> dude who played Doc Brown. No, that like, I just don't remember all the names off the top of my head, but like, uh, it was like Do Doc Brown, the guy Ooh. who played Doc Brown. Uh, That's a really low rating though. Fucking guy with mustache. I'm forgetting his name. Like his whole thing is a mustache. Yeah, Christopher Lloyd for for Doc Brown. 
I mean, you could always just IMDB it up there so you can read the names off properly. You know, I could. Uh -huh. It's a 2012 movie? Yeah, it just came, it just one day came out unceremoniously. Uh, okay, so... I'm sorry, it was a cartoon. Yeah, no, hold up. The, the rabbit hole goes pretty fucking deep. So, it had Charlie Sheen, Hilary Duff, Eva Longoria, Wayne Brady, Christopher Lloyd, Chris Kattan, Larry Miller, like, all, all these really big names for the time. Jerry Stiller. Uh, Is that Ben Stiller's rubber? Uh, I believe father, I want to say. I don't know. I guess he does kind of look that old. Yeah. Uh, James Arnold Taylor. Because Good old fucking Titus. Robert Costanzo. Fucking James, uh, fucking James or Arnold Taylor is a good voice actor. Okay. But, uh, yeah, it was more or less all these big names uh -huh. involved in a movie and the cover, uh, whenever it pulls up the cover, you notice that suddenly it's brand. All brand. I just see hot dogs, burgers, and pizza. And the, the tuna fish guy, Twinkie Man. Oh. Elastic, if Elastic Pelican. And Mrs. Buttersworth. And Mrs. Buttersworth. And then, like, the two protagonists very, very deep in the back. Mm. Oh, it's even worse. Featuring Charlie the Tuna, Elastic the Stork, Twinkie the Kid, Mr. Clean, Mrs. Buttersworth, Hawaiian Punchy, the California Raisins. Chef Boyer D and the uh, Chiquinta Banana person um, all at the bottom in a bigger space than the leading headlines. Charlie Sheen, Eva Longoria, and Hilary Duff. Yep. Ay, 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 ay. Why? It's, it's a fucking mess and a half. Well, I mean, if you want to see a movie that's a mess and a half, in my opinion, watch uh, Sausage Party. It's Ugh. that's deliberately a mess. That one's supposed to be a mess. That oh. that one right there was that movie is like a lot of people are speculating that it was a uh, the money scam. <laughs> but yeah, pretty much. But yeah, everything's fine aside from this note. A note. Hold up. I think I think my had a burp coming. No, okay, guess not. Remember how I told you I lashed out at my uh, dead girlfriend, uh, dead ex uh, ex's sister? Yeah, and I got this note from her. Let's see. Wow, she must really feel bad about the whole thing. As do I. So what's the problem then? same fear that drove me away from her in the first place right give her brantini you oh will you there's a little story i want to tell you right brantini wow the smell of this incense is making me really calm uh, 12. i totally wasn't expecting this uh, yeah i could double that ew that is Terrible passion lip because that four, movie was five, just six, one, it was two, three, cringe. Four, five, six, one, two, three, one, two, three. You could say you could have also safely have said it uncomfortable, but that works as well. Oh, no, 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 cringe is the proper word, believe me. I don't, I, I can't say that I don't recommend it because it, it may be interesting. Ah, uh, for some people, but I. Mm. But you know, you know what else people should watch? People should watch Night Court. Aged and mixed. Aged and mixed. I, I I can't fucking believe an obscure TV show that I literally only heard of from Red Letter Media got a reboot, and it actually apparently turns out to be pretty okay. Which one? A uh, Night Court. Never heard of it. But yeah, me neither. <laughs> I, like I said, I literally only heard of it because of Red Letter Media, oh. and uh, it, it turns out that, uh, at least from one person that I've heard about, 
but from his it's not bad then i'm just like so the litmus in my head is as compared to what <laughs> when, Anyways, when aged and mixed whenever somebody says the, the word reboot for like television stuff i actually think about the tv show reboot from the 90s they almost re uh continued that fairly oh. recently it got canceled unfortunately no, i really liked that show it was cool it was it was ahead of its time dude it so was like one of the YouTubers slash streamers that I watch is was like absolutely down to have it come back because he's a big fan of Reboot and uh, it didn't work out. Reboot, Reboot. <laughs> oh, it's Reboot, Reboot. Or perhaps a soft sea boot. Ooh. Really? Oh, that's unfortunate. The newer version of Reboot or Night Court? Oh, oh, yeah, it's that's unfortunate. I hate it when they think that they have to remake something. This might. Oh, I'm, I'm about to take a bite. I hate it when they think that they have to remake something, but make it completely different than it originally was. And that just kind of ruins it. <laughs> I mean, there's probably a lot of uh, problems with the ma with mainframe studio. So anyways, here. This is the thing. Let's start. Oh. Boo, boo, boo. Oh, hell no. Oh, it, the reboot did happen. Oh boy. Oh boy. But well, lasted one season. Anyways, uh, brain. Okay. This is the story of a girl who grew disillusioned with one of her sisters. Soon it became, uh, soon it became animosity and not long after she d uh, distanced herself completely from that sister. With time, the girl would become attached to her eldest sister, looking up to her uh, uh, achievements. All I can look at right now are those boobs. You're good, Asphodel. Get some rest. Get some rest. Thanks for joining us. Yes, thank, thank you so very much for joining us. No, no, no. Rest well. Set sister would uh, would even marry the girl's best friend not soon after. And after the girl went uh, into college, sad sister would quit her job. The sister was worried sick about leaving her uh, baby kid alone, prompting her to quit her, her high-ranking job. And what if I hire your high-ranking lips? Oh my god, shut up. <laughs> the girl, even as an adult, felt betrayed. Her role model sister went against every- uh, yeah, her role model sister went against everything she held in her- uh, in her high- yeah, in high esteem for. She was no longer a child, and yet she felt like a part of her had crumbled. <laughs> hey, hey, Joe, I can lift your sweater. You want to see? I bet you want to see. All right, enough. Enough? Shit. Peace out. Er, I mean, I know the girl is you and your sister is... Your eldest sister, please get to the point. Oh, don't be rude. I mean, <laughs> right. Point is, if you don't face her, she will be heavily disappointed. Just trying to make amends with you. That must make uh, must take courage. Lots of it. <laughs> yeah, you're right. My mouth's dry. Can I get a beer? Right. A beer. Big belly beer! It feels like she's like doing crazy. I would do. Got a big old big belly beer! Pat's Blue Ribbon! 
you have a... Uh, yeah, I have a, I have a Kirin Ichiban in the fridge. I'll I probably put, have that tonight. I think I put it in the door because of all the groceries I was bringing in today. I need to actually, like, sit down and drink that. It's just... It's so much beer. <laughs> If there was an easy way to seal it up without losing the carbonation and flavor, I'd do it. Mm. Uh, mm. mixed. That's a big old bear! If you let me try it and I like it, we can pair it. I'm, I'm go. I bought it. And if I don't like it, you know who you can share it with. Yeah, it'll turn into like half and half and a, a glass for him, half and a glass for me, or half a glass for you and half and a glass for me. It's a pretty big fucking can. Yeah, it's like one of those big old fucking tall boy cans. Like, uh, th 23 ounce cans. Uh, it's, it's bigger than that. But it's approximate. Yeah. Here. Thanks. So, tell me, did you and this Gabby girl get along? Oh, yeah. Never had brothers or, and sisters, but once Lenore introduced me to her as her sister-in-law, she got so excited about having a new sister that she clung to me a lot. Aww. I helped her in her studies, read books, I read books with her, played with her a lot. She was, she was pretty much my sister too. Yeah, I have to leave, but I'll tell you this. That's both a big and little sister if you don't grant that girl the chance of talking to you. I'll never forgive you. That glare. Yeah. That's kind of hot, yeah. actually. <laughs> Jeez. Wrestling! <laughs> oh, there's a small New Year's party this Saturday if you're interested. Yeah, sure. I'll be there. Or here. Rumor, I won't forgive you. I'll throw you in a fucking ditch. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'll go take my break. All right. Oh, you were here? You were quite absorbed in the conversation just now. Jamie even said goodbye to you, didn't you hear? anything comes up do you want to take the chance to get something to munch on you can have the, a little bit of my food because I think I got too much yeah let me hit save real quick okay now now we're doing a, like an official capacity BRB you should set up an ad if you're gonna do BRB uh, yeah, just a quick like I don't know what like 30 second yeah. BRB ad uh, I hope look. that's alright with you guys I just figured we could run a quick and do a, a, a 90 second ad break real quick. Get up, rest, or stretch legs, go potty, take yeah. a bite of something. So I recommend everybody hydrate if you need to. Running the ad. Well, I'm going to unmute the VOD track first. Right. Running the ad now.
Okay, and we're back. Sorry, I forgot to unmute everything. Thank you. Hello, AKL. I, I that. Also, what's up, AKL? Welcome, welcome. Also, yeah, no, I, I, ha uh, I have that. Or so I got somebody to get that isolated for me, and I appreciate it. I'm gonna work on getting that as an outro screen. It is now safe. Thank you. Hmm. Sorry about that. Ah, okay. Stomach's attacking okay? me for some reason today. It's less chilly today. Just gonna go right in. Jill, the kid's looking for you. I'm doing all right, and it definitely feels like a Monday for me as well for some reason. Uh, like, I'm not the only one, right? Well, aside from AKL, we're not the only one, right? That it feels like a Monday for some reason? Uh, no. It doesn't feel like a Monday to me. Well, it, well, lucky it you. feels like my no. It, it literally feels like my usual Sunday where I go to work tomorrow. Oh yeah. So I'm a little like. Ugh. Also, yeah, pre rolls. I'm honestly that like I know Twitch doesn't like uh, uh, like people talking about that, but ads are genuinely like pennies. Just pennies on the income. For the for Twitch, or for Twitch streamers, like I, I wish it was a little bit more because people are would be a little more keen on letting ads play, but it's like just sent whole whole pennies, and they're annoying ads. <laughs> oh yeah, no, okay, no, that's valid as long as I'm not partnered. So yeah, no, ads are just pennies. Even from what I've even been told, uh, I heard from like other streamers who were partnered. It's just like pennies. There's no reason to really run them. I just run them just because it gives people something to look at. <laughs> well, you do mention that it helps the stream. It, it does, but it's like, it's pennies. Right, so it's no big deal if you don't. <laughs> that's why, that's, why I, don't, that's why I don't require people to stick around for ads. Like, if yeah. they want to bail out, they can bail out. Well, I mean, it's not like you can make them anyways. Yeah. It helps to have somebody be like, yeah, just, if you don't feel like sticking around for the ads, fuck it. Let's go. <laughs> yeah. Like, I'm not gonna ask people to turn off ad block. I know how annoying ads are. Anyways. Naya's being drowned slowly. I have to cram in uh, between games to avoid uh, the pre-rolls and it's- Yeah! There's, I believe there's actually a way to turn off pre-rolls, but I think that's, uh... Queen. Like... You have to go out of your way to do it. I didn't know that you stream Magic the Gathering. Yeah, there's a PC game. Well, no, I know that. I just oh. didn't know that they streamed Magic the Gathering. I didn't know they did that. I, I I used to have, like, this box that had, like, three separate Magic the Gathering decks in it. Oh, that's lame. Also, I got another... Am I... Did you just say I was lame? Oh. No, I said that's lame. Oh. I love... Oh, my God. Why are... I'm getting so many fucking phone calls lately. Did you did you fix your um uh the 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 thing that you put on job websites? Your oh god, words fail me. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah, I know what you're talking about, but that one's uh, that number was is not listed on my history. Whatever. I can leave a message if it's important. Yeah, which a lot of people don't. Thank you. Yes, resume. Did you finish your? Did you fix your, fix your resume? Yeah. Well, then well no, I didn't. Fix, I didn't. I didn't fix my resume. Actually, I'm fixing that after we. I get settled in at the new job. Okay. Oh yeah. By the way. Yeah, I have a new Surprise. job. He got hired by. Uh, Don't say no. Stop. Really? Oh, sorry. You can cut that off in the bottom. No, later. I can't. You have a. It, I have to re-upload the bod, and I have to. Oh, I, I apologize. I did not know we couldn't talk about what it's be it's best to not like say where you work because you don't know who's gonna have a, a hate boner for you oh yeah they also yeah probably didn't come through very well fortunately but yeah it's one of those things that i'm just like overly cautious about because i know how uh vitriolic people people can get 
Okay, well, I apologize and I'll try not to do it again. Hopefully, I didn't really come through too well anyways, because I just kind of blah, 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 bit. Also, especially with me making that remark I made on Twitter yesterday about Dark Souls. I, I'll, I'll fucking do it too. What? Okay, I didn't see it. But uh, I more or less said if I ever stream a Soulsborne game, I'm going to go out of my way to use all the weapons to make people upset. That make oh. people upset. Yeah, I did see that. Okay. I'm going to use the Estoke, the Ludwig's Holy Blade, and Clatter. just like, if I get a shield, I'm going to put it on the ground and jump off a cliff. Oh boy. Yeah. There, there are some people out there that get really, really, really pa uh, overly passionate mm -hmm. about Dark Souls to the point that if you use the wrong weapon in the wrong context, they get really, really upset. Oh my God. Yeah, and I'm just kind of like, yeah, I just that that sort of stuff makes uh, it despawns the item. I believe. This sounds like the people who would get mad at an anime where the character has a bow and arrow and they run out of arrows so they start using the bow as a sword. I've seen something like that where the, the bow was kind of like serrated on one side where you don't usually touch it. And so they ran out of arrows. So they started hitting people with their bow because it was a big, strong bow and it's a huh. cartoon. So what do you expect? And it was working because it was serrated, I guess. I don't, I don't remember what it was. It was a very long time ago. I just That comes to mind when, when people complain about using a weapon the wrong way. All right, well, I'm going to resume here before we get uh, pushed into just chatting status. Yeah, this is confusing. Why would a kid be looking for jelly? Oh, shit. That's why. Um? Murder, 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 murder. Murder, 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 murder. Moon, moon? Wait, somebody's using the word, the name Moon Moon seriously? That was a meme a long time ago. It was, yeah, what's your wolf say. name? And if you had two specific Based letters as your, if you had two specific letters as your wolf name, your wolf name would be Moon Moon. And so people started making jokes about the wolf that would be named Moon Moon would be mentally declined i'm talking directly into it do you want me to use that again i hear i hear the yeah well i'm salivating for some reason oh okay i gotta adjust the screen it's the lima just aim it low there you go perfect okay okay sorry is that better yeah but yeah um it, it was yeah, it was, it was a silly thing. Go ahead. Okay, gonna resume here. Mm -hmm. Hey. Ah! Norma. Whew. You're bad. Every time Anna pops in, I'm noticing the channel goes to no signal. Can you change it? Nope. She's, she's taking control of the signals. She's hijacked her shit. A, a moon no, is the term you. for a moon's moon. Okay. You do know I'm not giving you any drinks, right? Crap, I said that out loud. Yeah, um, actually. What does it thank you? Oh, shit. She thought it was for her. Ooh. Thank me? Well, for starters, by not com uh, complying and giving me alcohol. Everything else would have fallen apart if I, if I had some. Oh, so responsible, Joe. I kind of faced my mom and told her all about the pressure she was putting on me. And I said I wanted to figure out what I wanted to do. And... Well, she didn't speak me to me for two days. After that, she told me that it'd be a waste, uh, waste to spend money in a, in a university just for me to not give it up my all. So she told me to still go to college, uh, to the college course. But that was, uh, but, but that... Uh, but that I was free to do, uh, free to explore. 
glad to hear that. And, well, I wanted to thank you for that. Me? If I just rushed, rushed headfirst into my original plan, things would have gotten ugly. And you were right. I would be hurting her for the sake of hurting. So, thank you. Yeah, don't worry about it. I'll leave before it's too late outside. Be careful. Oh, so sweet. Please shut up. Hey. <clears throat> hey, Jill. Mind helping me here? Ah, sure. Make a bleeding Jane, please. On it. Bleeding Jane! For you. Make a big boy! So, six, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And. Blend it, baby! Blend it, blend it, blend it, blend it, blend it. Oh, yeah, big gal, I should say. Lead Jane. Big gal. And. Zoom! Get that little. Get that little, uh. Philip CDI, uh, Western shooter game. Where the guy slides the beer across the counter and you like you have the option to just not put your hand out and it just slides past and onto the floor and the guy just looks awkward. He's just, it's just like Oh. Oh yeah. I was supposed to do something. I might I might stream that at some point just for shits and giggles. It's a really it's a really bad game, but like there's some jokes in that game that have like really good humor to them. What game did you say it was? I forget, but uh that's a Retro Prey video called True Shit. Oh. That you'll that whatever game that they're playing there. Oh, okay. You know what you should stream. That weird game that you were playing yesterday, where it looked like you were pissing in order to fly. Oh, uh, Noida. Yeah, I actually plan to stream. I actually plan to stream Noida pretty soon. A town with no name. Thank you, Malkin. It was a town with no name. Also, hello, Malkin. I also, welcome, welcome. How long have you been? How long have you been in here? Because they've probably been lurking. <laughs> it seems like. Like, people who, who just pop in, and I'm just like, oh, look, there's a person. But I can't read the name because it's inverted colors. Could you turn it just a tiny bit so that I can see it a little better, please? Yes. The screen, yes. The, the colors are inverted when it's like that, and I can't see certain names. Yeah, right, I'm, try I'm, trying to, I'm trying to find, I'm, uh, I'm going to probably, this this paycheck, invest in a mini monitor for uh, Streamcat and just set it, like, right here. That would be perfect. Uh, I, I know Lilliput sells mini monitors for pretty cheap, but I can also just get, like, uh, built, get a little uh, small built monitor and mm -hmm. built it into a Raspberry Pi and just work with that. Raspberry Pi. I've always wanted to see one of those because they're so tiny. They're small and they're so fucking cool. A lot of people are talking about how they're surprised that they're so strong for how tiny they are, and I'm like, you'd be surprised how they're, you know, how they're tiny. They're they're strong as a phone. Like this, the, my uh, S20 that I'm holding right now. It's, there's a Raspberry Pi that's as strong as this. Well, it's it's funny how people are like, how can they make technology so tiny and have it work? I'm like, you have a phone. Yeah, the uh, res the Raspberry uh, the Raspberry Four is insane. Uh, I'm actually gonna grab. Uh, Hold that up real quick. I mean, we've been procrastinating a lot on this stream today, but I kind of don't care today. Twenty sixty four. Twenty sixty four is on the queue. There's another game that's going to be played before I get to that. But uh, there's a, there's a a, 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 cup, a game or two that's going to be in the queue before that that I have planned for it. I mean, I still want to. I still want to do 2064. I've been wanting to play that game for a while, and streaming it is a very good excuse to do it. So it's it's on the queue. I really want to. <laughs> yeah, hold Incense. up. It's, I know it's so good. It's making my oh, brain go sweet. fuzzy because, like, I'm relaxing, and I don't. I'm. I don't relax like. Yeah. See the uh, Pi Four. Is eight gigabyte uh, RAM, and what? it actually can be used for a game console. What? Yeah, if you install the correct OS, it can be used for a retro console on its own. Uh, like PlayStation Two levels of retro console. So you might as well get one of those and put all your Steam games on. No. 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 Or a uh, Steam game. <laughs> that that is the Steam Deck, which I will show you that later on. Steam. Yeah. Here, look. Stream Deck. Steam Deck. 
<laughs> no, it's it's literally just like a a, B, a PC based uh Nintendo Switch. I'll pull that up right now. Wait. Yeah. Same. What? Yep. It's a. I, I, it looks like if if I can afford it upon launch, I will be getting one and streaming off of it exclusively to offload uh the GPU encoding from my computer onto one of these things because these are apparently powerful enough to do that um, and I have the hardware to capture these that sorry my brain just went really fuzzy for a second that literally looks like what you, if you a hadn't Nintendo switch yeah if you, no 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 yes but no if you hadn't shown that to me at all and said a PC version of a Nintendo Switch. This is pretty much what my mind would have envisioned. Yep. Yeah. Also, I, I know I keep mentioning this, but... Face the mic. I know I keep mentioning this, but I think I'm going to have to ask if I can have incense at work. Because... The smell of this one is... Also, look at that price. Wow, my brain. Which one is it? The 64? Oh, it's only 400... <laughs> it's cheaper than my effing laptop. Yeah, no, like you have a, hell? a full PC gaming, uh, like full PC gaming piece of device. Mm -hmm. Yes, we're talking about the Steam Deck, which I, I'm excited for as time has gone on, because apparently there, uh, like there's more going on about that. Uh, it just came out that they're going to be using Proton to emulate, well, quote unquote, emulate, uh, Windows games. So there's a good chance you're, you're just going to have full access to your Windows library. Fastest storage, premium anti-glare at glass. Yeah, so that's exclusive legit. Exclusive carrying case. I mean, that's cool, but uh, exclusive Steam community profile bundle. What is that? Uh, it just gives you, it just turns your Steam uh, profile into a themed thing. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. And then exclusive virtual keyboard thing. Okay. I mean, those are cool things, but I mean, not that big. But yeah, we're, we're going to be getting like a full uh, like Windows gaming Proton Suite, which is going to be amazing. Uh, more people have been talking about it and actually have been, like NDAs are starting to lift. So more details are starting to come out as as things are being set in stone. Oh. So this is going to be really fucking awesome. I like how it's asking if you want to install Steam at the top of your screen there. Yeah, install. it's because it's it's on uh, through browser. Anyways, I know, it's just so funny. Let's let's uh, focus on the game here. I'm going to get this off screen because that's distracting as fuck. Retro Arch. And yeah, uh, uh, the res uh, the Raspberry Pi is really good for retro arch. The retro. Arch. It's just emulation console oh, or okay. an emulation OS. Kind of like the that dolphin thing. Yeah. For... yeah. Is that, I believe there's a uh, dolphin or now for Raspberry uh, for not Raspberry uh, retro Pi. Oh wow. Oh. Oh. oh okay. Anyways. Hey Joe, do you hate me? Hate is a harsh word. Also, yeah, PCSX2 is on RetroArch now, which is fucking amazing, because I finally got a hold of a core to run that. I hope you're not talking directly to me, because I don't know what any of that means. Hey, uh, so the PlayStation 2 is really weird about emulation. You have oh. to get a very specific BIOS core off of the console itself that you can only get from owning the console. Ugh. I own like four PS2s. You do? Yes, they're tucked uh, tucked away right now. Uh, I don't blame I don't blame the companies for doing the BIOS core shit because piracy is a very serious bit is very serious business and does need to be treated very carefully. But for the for the sake of preservation and uh, drumming up interest for old games, sometimes emulation is necessary. Why would you have four PS2s? Uh, long story. Okay, you uh, can uh, tell me later. Yeah, uh, I'll, I'll actually shorten it up because it's very shortenable by like one sentence. Okay. Long story short, uh, when PS2s get old, they'd like to eat discs. Oh. <laughs> Is it the PS2 or the PS1 where you have to flip it over? With the disc in it. Uh, PS1 it? is the one that... Uh... Also, I believe Extella Link... Uh, the, the second Extella game got released that has Passion Lip in it. Wait. You're, you're in a game? Uh, their namesake is in a game, yes. Oh. It's a fate game, I which I don't know if I will be playing on stream ever because... Oh, she's not an Extella Link. Really? That game can't, was in development during the time that 
she would have been... All right, I need to focus. <laughs> but yeah, need to focus here. Oh, she's only in extra CCC. Okay, that, that makes sense. But yeah, I need to focus. It's not against you directly, or rather, or, or you directly, but rather the fact that I can only, that only I can see you. Like I told you, if they wanted, they could see me. And why can I? You're the main character. Dunno. What are you? A cute girl. Right. That's not the echo. That's not the echo. It's the work. Right. You okay, Jill? You're making a lot of faces there. You no, know, yeah, just just remembering stuff from high school. You've eaten all of your cinnamon rolls already. Yes. Well, I love cinnamon rolls. I mean, I might give you mine because they're too dry. They, I can't eat them. They're for some reason dry bread like that makes me gag. That's why I was trying to have it with coffee, but I make my coffee too sweet. So the gl having a glaze would have made them a lot better. Yeah. No, making the bread not dry would have been better. That's why I chilled mine. mine my, the bread didn't dry when I chilled it. That sounds like the complete opposite of work. Yeah, I know. But okay, I'm, I'm I might put mine in the fridge. But yeah. Could you give me a hand here and serve a uh, server beer, please? Uh, yeah, sure. That's a big bear! Pops Blue Ribbon! Don't ever drink Pops Blue Ribbon, it tastes like shit. I never planned on it. Two, three, four. Uh, and that's a mix. Hey, you don't ever want to blend a beer. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm gonna be real, Pops Blue Ribbon I had once, and uh... If you ever want to drink because you're miserable, or miserable because you drink, Pabst Blue Ribbon is the first thing that comes to mind. It's a real American beer! One of those beers that they sold when I worked at, uh, the previous retailer place I worked at, uh, they sold Fat Tire, and it was cheap shit, but people bought it. Uh. <laughs> hmm, thanks. Would you lighten up if I showed you I can interact with the environment? Maybe it'll spook me, but let's try. Oh. What did she do? There. She changed the frame, which I actually like that frame a little bit more. What? Changed the frame? What are you talking about? It's dark now. It hasn't been like that the whole time? I'm cute now. I can't see anything. You sure? Yep. It's different now. Huh. Weird. <laughs> Nobody expects a Dorothy Quisition! Eee, that's cute. <laughs> Dorothy Quisition, Dorothy Quisition, ow. <laughs> I, I did my tongue. Can't believe I'm using the spare tongue so early in the night. <laughs> spare tongue? <laughs> Spare dog. <laughs> Honey! Oh! Hey, Dorothy. I'm making a quick stop for a drink. Can I get a fluffy dream? Oh, yeah, sure. <laughs> What's Anna? Fluffy dream. What's Anna gonna have to say about this one, huh? I almost fear what she's gonna say. <sighs> Two, three. Are we giving her alcohol? Yes. I don't think I don't think uh, Lil' are affected by it anyways. Not as much, I think. I, de I think it depends on their. Uh, uh, I believe specifically uh, when we had Kuramiki in. <laughs> uh, she, I, I think it was her who mentioned that uh, alcohol doesn't really affect Lilum that like at all. Oh. Like they they have a different set uh, set of processes for alcohol and stuff. I could be I could be misremembering. We've only seen Kira Mickey once, right? Yeah, well, I mean, she's kind of an idol, so I, that would be kind of a 
Understandable thing to not see her. Kira! Kiki! Thanks! Oh, yeah, before you leave... What, are you guys throwing a New Year's party too? <laughs> yep. Sure, I'll be here then. Would she just freaking chug it down and leave? Knock that bitch back! Or maybe she's gonna go sit at a booth or something. Nah, she probably knocked that. She's probably just like... <laughs> <laughs> Got that vacuum cleaner noise coming on? I mean, with the throat like hers, I'm sure she could. I turn on my vacuum cleaner noise! I made a... Uh, a joke. I, I keep forgetting that I have a soundboard now, or I fixed the soundboard so I can now hit buttons. <laughs> I, I, I glossed over that, and I apologize. Yeah. You do? She's got things to do. Who, who does what? Sorry, I sneezed. Weird sneezes. <laughs> Anyways, I'm out for now. Oh yeah, Joe? Take, Take care, care of Becky, Becky please. Uh. As she's walking out. We don't hear that. Oh, what did it, what was the sound it was supposed to make? Fart with reverb. Oh. Which it was supposed to monitor, but it didn't. Uh, the, the dead ex-girlfriend's sister? Yeah, I want to say that was the... No, uh, I want to say that's the news reporter gal? I, I'm really bad with names. Nope to who? Oh, no. Nope to both! Oh, no. I don't remember who Becky was! Oh! Oh, right, Dorothy's namesake. Uh, the, her, Dorothy's being taken care of by a lady who lost her daughter named Becky. Oh! And she's been calling Dorothy Becky. Am I correct? Well, she. Man, she was in a rush. Okay, fuck that noise. Fireworks are sold out everywhere. I need to get them through more shady means. I'm gonna get one that explodes real good. It might be a stick of dynamite. Actually, I'm thinking about getting some copper charges. Hey, Gilly, you think a copper charge would be really cool? I think it'd actually be kind of dangerous. Nah, that's that's quitter talk. I'm getting myself a copper charge. I I'm surprised that Dana didn't originally go through Shady Means to get them in the first place. She just seems like that well, kind that of person who would go through the extreme first. That's why when she says Shady Means, my brain immediately went to like demolition charges. Mm. <laughs> yeah, and before Dana gets a, it gets a Komodo three thousand. Uh. <laughs> She's gonna buy them from the internet. She'll find them and put us all at risk of burning. Burning. I'll make sure there's an extra extinguisher at hand. Please. Oh, I guess that's it for today. I guess if the bar's gonna close down, it might, might as well go up in flames. Right. <laughs> you sure you're fine? I am. Don't worry. Hey, Jill. I'm gonna ask a silly question. You've seen my clients. You can assume I don't mind silly questions. Silly questions can only uh, can, can't get on my uh, our silly answers can uh, can get on my nerves though. Sorry, what did you want to ask? Do you know why they call them cat boomers? I mean, I guess there's their second set of ears look like the cats, but wait, wait, which ears do they hear from? Which ears do they hear from? Finish. If they were to wear headphones, where would they go? <laughs> I I don't know, Jill. Why are you asking this question? A a any anyways, <laughs> the word <laughs> boomer seems so out of place. Right, but it, where where do the headphones go? Also, not so much when you consider it's not them, but their parents who uh, were called such. Oh. Let's go back, uh, a bit back first. You know why ca uh, cat boomers look like that, right? 
because they went through some uh, anti nanomachine rejection treatment while they were still a fetus, right? It's called the Yamazaki Roman uh, Romanova treatment. Or it was the Yam, uh, Yam, uh, Romaneko Yamada treatment. Roma. Seriously, though, but which ears do they listen from? Uh, yeah, on track, on, on, on track, Jill. Let's call it the catification procedure. It's not only the first successful genetic treatment on a fetus, but also the first way to fight nanomachine rejection. Moreover, that research had a bit of a rocky story. Funding, funding got cut in the middle of it at, uh, at a crucial point that uh, could be could make or break the whole thing. Not to mention Zaibatsu Corpse. Uh oh. <laughs> Mishima Zaibatsu. Uh, hello, take on meme. Also, hello, take on meme. Catification. Not to mention Zaibatsu Corpse's uh, record of not addressing nanomachine rejection at all. The rest of the research was funded by uh, Maki Stinkovich. Did that right? Good. <laughs> yeah, happy name. Was it Stinkovich? Let's call him Stinkovich for now. He's a businessman who whose unborn daughter got diagnosed with early nanomachine rejection. Stengovich got fun, uh, Stengovich funded research, and in a desperate move, his wife uh, uh, offered herself and her daughter as test subjects. Of course, this experiment was a success. The girl, uh, Sylvia Stengovich, didn't die. She became the living testament of a of scientific breakthrough. But then the story of how things played out for uh, Sylvia Stengovich got sensationalized in the media and created a weird fad. No, uh, I will have to double check on uh, double check on that because I'm really bad at like placing names on uh, how many things. servers you have. Yeah, I, I have like a number of servers, and I keep tr I keep track of a lot of names, unfortunately. Mm. But. If you drop a DM on me, there's a good chance that I'll be able to uh, pinpoint it a lot faster. Yeah. Maybe bad. Parents made their unborn children go through, uh, through the catification procedure, even if they had no ailments at all. All because one particular girl whose life got saved uh, through that treatment became a media darling for a bit. And there you go. A whole generation of kids with those cat-like protrusions got born. Also, seriously, which ears did they listen to through? Jill, no, no one, no one cares. Just, Actually, just ignore the question, okay? <laughs> Look, shut, just shut ignore up. that question. Just pretend, pre pretend that they only have one set of ears for a second. All right? <laughs> no. And their parents got cat called cat boobs. A generation of parents obsessed with those cat-like features. The fact quickly passed, but the term remained in use. Eventually, Cat Boomer just started being used for people with those protrusions instead of their parents. Mm. You keep calling them protru protrusions. What is that? Because that's what they are. Eh? You didn't think those things on their heads were ears, right? <laughs> Answered my question, didn't they? Sure, they can be moved because they're somehow connected to facial and ear muscles. As they can move like a cat's and react to their mood. But in the end, they're just appendages with no real function. So your your question's answered. They they hear with their human ears. They're vestigial. Yeah. Oh! Oh! Okay, welcome, welcome. I know that I know that name now. Go ahead and click on it. Let's see. Yep. Oh. That's the person. They're they're in a, they're in uh, one of my four, fourteen servers, or one well not one of my but one of the fourteen servers because I don't own that in. one. Yeah. Huh. It still surprises me a bit though that the biggest mutation they got uh, get after the treatment is just that. Those ears are a small miracle on their own. People have been born with no uh, eyes for less intrusive pr procedures. Right. Bieber, I can't see because I have no eyes. Wow. <laughs> okay. It's an old Harry Partridge cartoon. Her 
Harry Parker? Yes. It, I, I believe it's the sequel to the uh, the Justin Bieber show cartoon. I, I did he what? Yes. Justin Bieber had a show. No. It, I'll link it to you later. Uh, it, uh, it, those who are familiar with Harry Partridge knows how how surrealist he can get sometimes. I just noticed that he's the same guy who did Doctor Bees. You could probably pick Gil's nose with your pointer thing. <laughs> no. <laughs> And you're like, wait, what am I doing? You can pick your friends, but you can't pick your friend's nose. True. You really thought they were functional ears, huh? You can pick your friends. Let's nose. say you learned quite a bit today. Thank you. Yeah, don't worry. I feel like I should apologize for taking uh, talking so much instead. And keep in mind, I'm fucking up the terms. I don't know what you're saying. Uh, someone got protrusions because of a catification procedure. Now I'll keep it in mind. Wait! What? Yeah, that guy's name was Stengovich. Eh? Oh! I just remembered uh, Sylvia Stengovich was around my age, and when I was a teen, uh, and when I was a teen, there were some TV specials featuring her. And I just remembered that I had the biggest crush on her. Oh, now that I think about it, that crush had me very confused back then. Did you? Need to just uh, need to shout just now. I'm not sorry. Sorry, not sorry. <laughs> In any case, I'm out for the day. All right, careful out there. Yeah. All booze and no firecrackers makes Dana a dull girl. Oh, I need a copper charge. What is this? A glass that has the ibuprofen in. I'm gonna move that here in a bit. Oh. Well, it just keeps the probably answer stream. <laughs> I was thinking a lot about Kira and Miki buying one of her posters will prevent her from getting. Too I thought I already had one. I thought you did too. Maybe you need another one. Maybe. Kira. Kira, Miki poster. Also, yeah. You you. Hold up. Let's back up for a second. $10,000 for rent. So for the record, our rent is almost $2,000. Now imagine the US dollar, at least shown in this context, converted to yen. That would be about how much we're paying for. <laughs> and she seems to own like a... A studio apartment. Studio, yeah. Also, Milk, it's been a hot minute. Welcome back. He's been here this whole time. I know, but they haven't spoken, so... Oh. Are you... I thought you were done with that. What? Looking it up? No, that what? That looks like No. Oh, that's you. Oh my god. Version. Okay, no, I thought okay, never mind. It's okay, no, you're fine to lurk, obviously, but I just I haven't seen you speak in a bit hot minute, so I thought I'd, you know, say hello again. Yeah, they've been they've been, they've been here this whole time. They just lurk. Yay! Joining game thingies are fun. No, so what what it look look this up? Well, okay, cautiously look this up. I believe it's called a copper charge. Uh -huh. There's a demolition thing called a copper charge, and I'm gonna uh, probably. I like what Nexus said. Hold on, let me confirm that. It's like it's activated with blast cord, but it, it's like a, it's a copper dome with plastic explosive lined on the inside, and when it blasts, it sends all the copper forward as well in a pointed charge. Like shrapnel. Uh, that's definitely a word I would use for it, but I don't think a demolitions expert would use that for it either. Well, shrapnel usually means that it shatters, right? Uh, like sh up. shattered metal in a, an explosion. I, okay, so they don't have the name posted on it immediately, but, uh, yeah, it's more, it's more or less a, yeah, it's, it's technically slag. But it's a point. It's a pointed charge that's meant to penetrate, uh, like thick walls of concrete. Huh. Not concrete, stone. Hold up, I'm waiting for the subtitle to pop up. Uh, regardless, if you want to see what they are, there's a 
slow mo guys video called massive uh, massive explosive chain re chain reaction at uh, two hundred thousand frames per second. Go check that out. Uh, Dan is a demolitions expert in the British Royal Army, and him that's his most like the vi in that video he is by far the most smart person on that entire uh, scene, and it's fucking hilarious because like Gavin looks like the idiot for once. Oh dear. Yeah, it's it's hilarious. Okay, so I need to buy the poster. I'm not making a lot of noise on my. No, you're good. Okay. Trying to get... These pretzel pop tarts. Oh god, they're good. Yeah, they're wonderful. I know. I just literally said I wasn't hungry anymore, but I, I'm hungry again. Also, <laughs> for. You've been talking a lot to with that Alma girl. Jealous. Or four. I mean, that is the most cat-like thing that they've done. Did you buy your poster already? Yeah, it's right there. Oh, right underneath the other one. Yep. It's bigger. <laughs> yep, there's the... Oh, no. No, she's already known about this. Oh, I know. It's just sad that it's becoming like an automatic... Uh, an actual thing now. Well, I feel like... uh. Hold up. I feel like I need a glass of milk. I didn't buy that lactate milk. But yeah. Uh, like typically, it. media coverage gets things uh, reversed. Like how we had with OnlyFans being uh, what everybody is now calling the post nut clarity. Well, the fact that they're thinking about taking back their ban. Uh, no, they, they are taking back their ban and they apologize. And I'm just like, yeah, I don't think they're going to stick to that because <laughs> whatever bank that they're working with is going to uh, go, oh, you guys support a lot of sex workers. Well, we're just going to pull funding again. Yeah, that's what I said. Yeah, they're suspending, suspending it. And it's a big, uh, yeah, give us like three or four weeks to gauge whether or not we're actually going to lose money. Uh, a lot of money. They're gonna lose a lot of money. Because they're gonna, that's like ninety percent of their people now. Is, they're gonna tumbler themselves. Is what's gonna happen. Uh, yeah. By just losing the flock of people who were out of touch with their reality. <laughs> but yeah. You know. The problem with fabricating a situation for free publicity is 90% of the time it backfires. Especially with the way things went, there's a high chance that that's just like, if they fabricated that, that was a damn bad move. Because now people are still looking to get away from that platform. Does that mean that they're not stupid enough to do it? Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, actually. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Melkin. He needed that laugh, as you can hear. Oh, that is so fucking good. We're opening a new bank, and we're going to call it... Uh, the Spank bank, bank, bank. bank. Could you mute for a second? I want to ask a question. All right, so uh, we're good. We got what we needed from the shop. Am I? December 29th. Good evening. Hey. Okay, so we got almost everything, but we're still missing a couple of things for Saturday. Also. <laughs> and so I designate you, Gillian Applegate, as the official guy who goes to buy the rest of the stuff. <laughs> Applegate? I have no idea who that is. Why me? I could send Jill, but I wouldn't uh, dare send a lady by herself. Hmm. And I could go with that. Uh, and I can go with her, but I believe the buyer should have at least two people in the vicinity at all times. You're not gonna say anything, Jill. If it means not being the delivery girl, I'm happy to fake helplessness. <laughs> 
fine. Give me the list. I'll be back sometime. Something tells me you're planning something, boss. That gives you that impression. Oh, look at that guilty face. Call it a... <clears throat> Gut Got feeling. Did you know Gil has a crush? What? He... What? 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 Oh, yeah. No, big drinks for everybody. A client of his. Girl that owns a uh, ba bazaar. That's bizarre. <laughs> She's been coming on to him for ages, and he's only just started opening up. But, he, he's, but he's taking steps backwards, and I'm not going to let him. He's opening up, for fuck's sake. He only just now noticed him. And so the errands will take him to the bazaar, I take it. That's right. Huh. All right, then. Off to the office I go. As for me, I'm just going to hit ready. No. Time to mix drinks and change lives. They need to make your Miki channel. Just so you can see your... Oh, okay. There you go. That works. <laughs> Get a little bit of the crush, huh? I don't know who this is, but this place is great. Oh, if it isn't. Hey, speak of the devil. <laughs> Woohoo! I don't remember what voice I was doing for you, but fuck it. What? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to do it. Uh, you're fine. Don't remember what voice I did for whatever. Hey, Jill, sorry, but is there anywhere I can hide? There's an unpleasant guy on my trail. Boss, stalked woman incoming. The door's open. Go ahead, door to the left. Thanks. Oh no. Back Hello on. there. Oh, hi there. The other one, that's the bathroom. Wait, what's the dog doing in the bathroom? <laughs> oh. You know. Um. Now, where did she? Oh, the hellhole. Perfect. Hey, kid, I'll have the usual. Pictures of, pictures of Spider-Man. Pictures of Spider-Man? Yeah, it's me making fun of, uh, what's his name from Spider-Man? I forget I forget his fucking name, but it's it's uh yeah. Okay, that's fine. I guess I told you I've I've not really watched any Spider Man's except for the. G. Jonah Jameson, thank you, thank you, thank you, both of you, all three of you, <laughs> all at once. It was a boom. <laughs> Literally, the only Spider Man movie I've ever watched was the cartoon one they made recently of all of the Spider Man characters. Yeah, then you should have seen. Uh, J. Jonah Jameson. I don't remember the names. It was, it was, as I said, it's the only one I've ever seen. Therefore, I probably only heard the name like a couple of times in that one movie. It's a little, it's, it's the white guy with the howdy or the Hitler stash as it's n uh, now become known. I still don't know. You actually only uh, one I remember is this, the little girl with the robot fighter thing. Fair enough. I don't even remember her name. Spider, wait, wait. I don't know. Spider something. A ass assing <laughs> Yeah, might as well. Right. Uh, you were huh, fine, Tigami. It would have been weeks. good to have that extra punch of Jonah Jameson. Mr. Donovan's usual drink, huh? And I believe that's a beer. He wants a big old beer. Big beer. What a big old beer. Give myself a big old beer. I'm hoping that this isn't one of those points where you have to give him something special because... Two, three, four. Oh, shit. Went to Columbia and had a big class in the classroom from Spider Man. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, that's that's awesome. Okay, so. Get all big old 
old bear! Big bear. Coming up. Big old bear! That seems right. I hate how people expect that you're gonna get it wrong. Well, I think this uh, Donovan here was probably thrown in at the la uh, at this point. The see if you're paying attention still. Uh, as if you remember his. Yes. Visual. Yes. Which uh, I re I recall because he was the first. He was the first. Yes. He wanted a big old beer. Explicitly a big beer. I think it was him that if you gave him the wrong drink in the first point, you get the free wrong drink thing because. It unlocked something, and I can't remember what that was. Because he goes, I know what I ordered. This is the very beginning. Very yeah, it's beginning. been a while. Yeah. The paper's been a mess lately. Do you think with all that, all that's happening, they'd stay, uh, they'd stay and do more reports? What is, what is that ninja? Uh. 91. Oh my, I don't know. Fucking Carnival's Walt kind of uh, puts a hamper on everything. I'm sorry, a what? Uh, Carnival's Walt. I don't know what that is. It's a uh. 36 inch. Yeah. No, that's about. That's doable. 36 inches. 36. Uh, and 36 and some change on it on inches. But they're all asking for vacations and I can't afford to be understaffed. So I had to come up with some sort of reward for whoever produces the most reports. I see no differences in my feed or difference in my feed though. Mr. Donovan, I don't mean to be uh, sound rude, but you do know the infamy of the augmented eye and, uh, with the general public, right? A shitty page that will over-sensationalize Woo! Over-sensationalize anything and report on let up, report useless things. Of course. Or, of course, I know. I mean, with the, with the way she's drawn, she's also propping them up a little bit. Keep in mind, uh, the, the measurement for bust is uh, done at a very specific point of the body which can make uh, it, when held certain ways, seem a lot larger. Yes, I know this thing. <laughs> Me of all people. You're fine. It's, it's true, though. It, it's measured at a certain spot, which may make it seem smaller or larger than it actually looks. Like somebody who's got rather small cup size might use their arms to hold them up and make them look bigger in a picture. And yes. Then, you know. And, and sometimes if it's, it's, if it's a heavier set person, in the case of Naya here, our little stream mascot, her bus may be measured in a much bigger size than it actually is. Well, she is holding her breasts up with her arm. But so. she still has her gut that would prop it up a little bit. Mm-hmm. I think. It's, just, it's the same thing with, like, how uh, waist is also not actually measured at the waist, but more at the hips. Mm-hmm. Which is why women's and men's pants are very different. Yeah. And the crotch. Yeah. Then why not try to rectify that image? Also, that doesn't surprise me. Yeah, that really doesn't because being an idol, she'd want to stand out amongst a lot of the yep. other females. Put it simply, I'm being clutched by the balls in, a non in, a, in the non-pleasant way. Sidebots so Corp and, and company have an eye on every publication they haven't bought yet. One of them once and they'll find something to find you with. Twice and they'll find your resources. Oh yeah, and you'll find your resources severely cut. Anything beyond that, and the base uh, best case scenario is they'll buy a, uh, buy the damn operation to keep it quiet. <laughs> Mr. Donovan is into C B T cock and ball torture. On the uh, uh, as as listed on uh, Wikipedia, the free uh, free encyclopedia that anybody can edit. Okay, you all want to hear like a small story. Wikipedia is owned by somebody named Thomas Wales. Yes. My father's name is Thomas Wales. At one point in time. You do know that that's going to give up. I, all right, no, you know, it's you, you're, of, you're being voluntary. Yeah, at one point in time, the owner of Wikipedia, Tom Wales, 
requested, like, he, he communicated with my father and requested that my father pay for some of Wikipedia because they were family, but we weren't related to him in any way. We just happened to have the same surname. It was very awkward. And measurements aren't really done on the bra. They're, uh, it's done with a string measuring tape that uh, across the chest. I have one. What? Yeah, it's that thump. It's the neighbors climbing their door. Probably. As usual. I know there are more no newsworthy things than whatever it is. Uh, yeah, whatever it, it is the lackeys put, uh, picked out uh, that week. But if I overstep, my ass is on the line. But he's being really careful. Yeah, really careful being chasing around fucking Miraniki right now. Miraniki? Kiramiki. <laughs> right, I mean, you are supposed to, well, okay. Technically, if you start out without a bra and never wear a bra in your life, the tissue in your breasts grow at a certain point and actually support themselves which is why when you take your bra off your breast tissues are in pain because they don't have that support that they would naturally have had you never worn an artificial support system the only reason people make you wear them is because it takes a while for your body to gain that support system and of course nipples tend to stick out of your t-shirt if you're not wearing a bra so it's, it's inappropriate I just see this whole hole is still in one place. Peace. The BTC has been going around, uh, going ape shit on closing bars lately. Oh yeah, that. Yesterday they closed one that served uh, as a key part of a drug trafficking ring. And last week they closed three small bars that served as illegal chicken restaurants. Illegal chicken restaurants? Chicken is illegal. Well, oh, that's right. They don't really eat real. Meat, meat in this yeah, I don't believe so. world. I think everything's kind of protein substitute. Oh, I bought huh. Beyond Meat for burgers. For our burgers. Cool. I might make that go forward. Anyways, not to mention there are uh, like a hundred people who have BTC cert or certificates but never use them. Instead, they keep those credentials around to stop police from raiding their homes or warehouses. I don't know about you, but it's obvious to me that some re a restructuring will begin at, at the BTC after this whole thing. Man, that shit ran deeper than I thought. And no news outlet talks about that. All right, kid, let's try Moonblast now. Come again? Hey, even I have to break the routine from time to time. I'm gonna get myself a big old Moonblast! Okay, nice. It, this, this, this is a really sugary one. All right, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. One, two, three, four. <laughs> yeah, already, it's twenty. One, two, one, two, one, two, three, four. On the rocks. Under room. Blend it. Blend it. I got a big old moon blast. Blend it. It's Here. <laughs> now let's see what the rock, what, what the rocks is all about. Um. So, what brought you here? No, right? Didn't you see a uh, little coming in here? Blue hair, big tits. Uh -huh. She's the one from the encore concert coming up. No, not really. Did she jump on the uh, jump to the roof then? Why were you looking for her? <laughs> <laughs> Did you want an interview? Not really. Just hitting on her. Uh, here it was right. Creepy stalker. Hey, I said hitting on her, not hitting her. Stop glaring. But why though? Are you that bored? And don't you have like a family or something? Have you seen that girl? Oh, Six. 
Also hot ass chicks. I'm suffering the weirdest combo of being hard as fuck and curious as shit right now. Something tells me he's never been with Alolan. I want to know just how detailed those King Class G CH1A models are, personally. Yeah. And so you followed her. Mm-hmm. Absolutely not. I mean, I've yet to meet a woman that can't resist the charms of Donovan D. Dawson. You're in front of one, and I'm guessing you have quite the selective memory. Like I said, you don't, uh, like I said, don't you have a family or something? A wife? Well, that woman cheats on me as much as I cheat on her. Mm. In fact, I'm pretty convinced she gets off on the thought of me cheating on her. Oh, sorry, did you hear that fart with reverb? <laughs> nope, didn't hear a damn thing. So, that little one isn't here, huh? Why is he red? I <laughs> uh, just, that's probably the color palette thing. This, this game uses the uh, PC Engine color palette, so things may seem a little off. Well, and it doesn't help that there are um, all those uh, those bar lights which tend to throw off different colors those those what are they the glass lights the yeah probably the neon lights yes they neon oh, I'm brain. sorry guys i'm having trouble wording today i'm braining at all i'll have to find a busty uh busty enough replacement tonight or i'll explode or so. Gee. <laughs> At least he doesn't end up Apparently it is the working. Type. It's just really quiet for some reason. I said, I was saying, At least he doesn't end up being the creepy type that goes after Dorothy. Hey, after you're done glaring, please serve me a pile driver. It's funny because he ordered the pile driver originally, and she said that she wanted to give him a pile driver like right face. What which is, is a exactly man? Happened. A miserable little pile of secrets. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna give him a pile driver. A suplex, then a pile driver. Suplex! No. Five, six. Planner geek. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And. Uh, all mixed. I'm okay. <laughs> you can tell I found I got the soundboard working by how much I'm gonna have fun with it again. <laughs> Here. <laughs> Seeing as she's not here, I have no reason to stay. Maybe I'll find someone that looks a bit like her. <sighs> the guy left? No. Oh, all right. Thanks for sheltering me, Dana. Hope your sister likes the video. Nah, thank you. Seems you had a hearty talk. Your boss is such a fun person. Her sister is a fan of mine, so I recorded a small video for her and took a couple of photos. Oh, that's nice of you. It's nothing really, and she did hide me, so it's the least I could do. But well, we're here already. Mind giving me something sweet? Sure. Giving her something sweet. Blueberry. 
Is it gonna cost you the two. most? Remember, you're supposed to be making really expensive drinks right now. That's valid. That's valid. And that's a large too. Hold up. Let's see if I can. 320. Moonblast. 250. I don't make sense. You can double it. 320 makes 640. So we keep 640 in mind. 220. No, it's 250. It was, this is 250, which makes so 500 if you. No, th uh, the 320 can't be doubled. Oh, yeah. Oh, so a Brantini would make a five hundred dollar. Yes. So a Brantini. Moonblast. Nope. Blue Fairy. We already looked at that it's one. It's gonna be higher than a, a, a hundred and fifty or two fifty. Yeah. So we're gonna do a Brantini. I believe that can be doubled. Let's see twelve. Sweet, 14, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 20. Yep. On the spot. Five, six. One, two, three. Four. Oh, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six. Also, Nexus, I did note your uh, piano woman. The only reason I didn't pick the piano woman is because it couldn't be doubled. Oh, God damn it. The naming on that. Oh, boy. Man, some, some of these people who do an uh, idol master need to be like, Page. carefully watched. Okay. Brandini. Really? Here. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. So, do you know why Donovan was following you? I don't know, but I wasn't in the mood to deal with him. His questions were a bit over the line last time, too. Not the worst I've dealt with, but I just don't want to humor him. I don't blame you. Seems like he was just trying to come on to you. You don't say. Well, not like he'd have a chance anyways. I'm not into older guys, and I'm already committed in a committed. Uh, I'm already committed to a relationship. Figure wait. Oh, we gotta do it right. Figure what? It's not common knowledge, and the ones that hear it, hear it try to dismiss it as rumors. But I've been in a relationship with my producer for a while now. Oh. Really? We were both single and that kind of stuff is bound to happen when you spend so much time together. But it all started when he read an entry I made on my blog entry about wanting to experience love and the like. I mean, at least his intentions were good. Oh. Brain just stopped for a second. Uh, he offered to help with that after he read it and I thought, sure, why not? I already knew him well enough, and it wouldn't hurt to try. Oh, how nice. He's a, he's a stick in the mud where planning is due, but he's a sweetheart otherwise. I see. You know, I've met two fans of yours lately. Really? Both of them seemed so excited when they were talking about you. It was amazing. <laughs> I don't like the term fan too much. It strikes them. It strikes me as a bit pretentious, in my opinion. I have many fans. Doesn't sit so well. I like to. I, I, I like many people who, who like my. Uh, many people who like my music better. Fan evokes an uglier and more pretentious image for me. Yeah, that can kind of. That's weird, considering that she came in and tried to make Jill a fan by forcing her to scream Hiramiki with her. I mean. It worked. <clears throat> do you like, uh, do you like what I do, Jill? Do you like my music? To be honest, I haven't had much exposure to your work, but the few things I've heard are really good. 
We say as we literally have the song playing in the background. Not gonna lie, having, uh, having talked to you, I feel like I wouldn't support you even if I didn't like it. That's so nice to hear. Hey, this will sound familiar, but do you have anything like tea? Oh, Let me see. Tea that you had to buy. Mulan. It's time for the Mulan tea. All right, I believe you just hit mix. And here you go. Perfect. Hey, you're a King Class CH1A, right? That I am. Oh. I mean, that's the unfortunate thing when it comes to st uh, stuff like that. Like if you talk to somebody who may be, uh, like a little more influential sometimes they get a little uh separated from how things are but honestly sometimes it's for the best because it, it it becomes like there's a lot just just goes into it that we've been seeing happening over the past few years we're like the parasocial relationship thing kind of has to happen Sure. Are there any differences between you and DFC 72? Uh -huh. Hmm. We both serve the same purpose, but DFC 72s have the port on their ha uh, ha heads, which make them more versatile. My line lacks that or the resilience of a DT uh, 01D uh, uh, D's, but we're a tad more polished elsewhere. More specifically, our voice simulators are advanced and our mu movements are smoother. A trade-off a uh, trade-off of functionality and, uh, and power for appearance, you could say. Ah, I see. Huh. I wonder if she was just supposed to, was trying to bolster her I'm a cosplayer and I have fans sort of thing rather than just saying oh yeah that's just a friend of mine and you say I you're they're your fan it, it kind of makes them feel like they're more important which kind of puts you down and that's not very nice and that would have been apology worthy but I mean if somebody wants to make themselves feel better they're probably not gonna apologize Yeah. That would be kind of crappy though, like, telling if somebody... I don't know, that, that's understandable. Yeah, you're, you're good. It would be kind of like, as crappy as if you had explained to other people that all of these are just your fans, but they're actually your friends. It would be very rude. So, anything new for this concert? Mm, well, it's an encore, so we're trying to make it uh, the same for those that couldn't go for the first uh, go to the first one. But we always try to spice it up, like maybe with the surprise song or something. Or you can just get everybody to scream, "Hero, Mickey!" Yeah, yeah. Well, there was one time I sang over, uh, sang a cover of the song by B Link. Of course, in return, they sang "Your Love Is a Drug." Huh. So you know the B-Link girls. Really nice kids. You'd be surprised how different from their onstage pers personas they are. Really? Suzu, for example, can be really childish at times. She also laughs a lot. And loudly at that. Meanwhile, Aina is a party girl at the run throw. They're not on tour. She spends her time partying like crazy. Huh. Hard to believe. I mean, their image is uh, that of, of stoic girls with little expression. Almost like living uh, living Victorian dolls or something. Well, they want to pop, uh, wanted to pop out in, in the public. They want to tell me if we want people to notice us, we have to break uh, the cutesy idol concept. 
And so they took the opposite route by becoming cool beauties with melancholic songs. I wouldn't say they went the opposite way. Or I wouldn't say they went the opposite way. The opposite of cutesy idols would be unkempt, tone-deaf girls swip, uh, spewing vitriol and hate. True, I guess. Well, I gotta go, but let's have a sparkle star first. Alright. I'm gonna assume the uh, Mulan T thing is a... Uh, just for that extra little bit there. So you could have... Uh given her just about anything and said that was sweet but the Mulan be specific well she wanted something that was like tea yeah yeah so sparkle star uh, two four of those three four two powder delta and age I'm just gonna throw some karma train in there Oh, shaky, 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 boop! Sparkle Star! I think the sparkle star to be more blue, you know? Eh. Less sunsetty. There you go! Uh. Uh. Sparkling! Well, it's always a pleasure, Jill. Please come again? Will do. She really ooed that drink all of a sudden. Oh, the handsome bartender. Nice to meet you. Gil's back. Um, uh? Boss, Gil's back. I'll take my break. Here I meet. Oh. Yep. Sparkle, sparkle. Spark <laughs> sparkle, drink a sparkle star. <laughs> I guess that makes sense, though. She's all blue. And we are definitely going to be finishing off this day. So... I forgot to save when I was in the room. Whoops. I'll be fine. Hey, I I like the, the my opponent character. Note to self: buy oil for that door. <laughs> no, no. The, the bar's about to close. Don't buy oil for the door. <laughs> it's like... RD swag. I don't... Uh, some of the emotes don't pop up properly on Twitch chat. Oh, yeah. Rainbow Dash. Okay. I'm a Pinkie Pie fan, personally, but... Yeah, just because my brain works like Pinkie Pie does. Yeah, just the, the door slowly opens and it creak, uh, creaks and you just hear Madness, our old friend. Hmm. Gonna stick with this playlist again. It's a good simple playlist. I just grabbed whatever at this point. I don't think there's anything specific. All right, then. Uh. And now the true test. Hold fast or expire. Gil, you're in my spot. Please. Derpamina Diane Pie. Oh my gosh, that's adorable. Oh, sorry. <clears throat> Also, you're cleaning one of the boss's chicken buckets. Oh. Did boss ask you to do that? If I told you she did, would you believe me? Without a doubt. Let's go with that. <laughs> Radio. Okay. Greetings. Ah, Stella, what can I get for you, Nya? What? Uh, did you just nya at me? I'll go with the Bleeding Jane today, Nya. Bleeding Jane! A big old bear! <laughs> it's fun. Three. Although, I do four, think five, that Derpy Hoops six, was uh, one of the two, better side characters. Three, so. Four, five, six. Like, yeah. 
What have I told you now? That we're gonna get a big old beer. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think I got everything. Yeah, I should accidentally problems. take that dream deck and move it. You wouldn't find it. <laughs> accidentally. <laughs> I would know immediately. Yeah. Where did you put it? Put what? You know what I need. The thing what that I requ the thing that I require to run my streams. Ooh. See. I'm Three, four, five, six. Four, five, six. I don't know. Luna would be just. Uh, I did a Rainbow Dash cosplay when I went to um, Secure Conflicts, but I mean. I, I didn't really have much. Just a rainbow wig and a pair of pony wings, and yeah. Go ahead. There you go. Thank you, Nya. What brought you here today, Nya? Waiting for say, Nya? You need to stop right now. I came by myself, actually, Nya. I was in the area and stopped. Uh, stopped to say hi, Nya. I only had a rainbow wig. Oh. Huh. I didn't have a pink wig. It's pretty interesting, though. When I first saw you, I doubted you'd ever come here again. Well, this place is nya comfortable. Yeah, I must admit. That does sound really pretty. It's so quiet and secluded, nya. It's also really clean. Or it's also clean, nya. Really clean. Gil's the one you can hold that one. I'm assuming FF is final. Yeah, uh, the pixel remasters are uh, coming out. Huh. I'll have to hit you up for some info on that after stream. The guy takes pride in how clean he keeps uh, things around here. If you ever need cleaning, st uh, cleaning staff, he's a uh, nice pick. Really, Nia? Mm. <laughs> Passion, do I have you on Discord? Are we friends? On Discord? I don't remember. <clears throat> oh, it's okay. I forget. I mean, do what you gotta do. I just forget who I have on my thing all the time. And then I look at a name and go, hell is that? Hmm. Eh. <laughs> He's a bit out of it today, though. Nice seeing ya. Hey, Jonia, have you heard of the new gold rush in the city, Nya? Gold rush? Everyone is paying small fortunes to get their hands on a piece of white night suits. I think I heard or read something about that, but I'm having doubts, so probably not. In any case, how is it a gold rush? Well, yeah, the tech behind the suits was always safely guarded, but after the events at the bank... Sorry, yeah. After the, after the events at the bank, the suits were remotely shut down, breaking many of them in the process, yeah. Many units dropped their armor right there and fled without, uh, w when the lynchings went on, yeah. Any white knights still stuck in their suits had to take the armor off manually to run away, and yeah. It all happened in the middle of the lynchings, so they'd be sitting ducks if they didn't, yeah. Some weren't that luckily, lucky, yeah. They got beaten up while they were, weren't, uh, weren't able to move, yeah. So between the suits becoming glorified paperweights and many white knights going on the run, there ended up being a lot of junk laying around, ya. Yeah. The whole scientific community is rejoicing. They're on a race to reverse engineer the suits and make as much technology as possible from them, ya. Yeah. And of course, even single pieces of the of the armor fetch a high price these days, meow. Did you just say meow? Don't you fucking dare. Can anyone see any profit from that research to, to justify those expenses? 
it's new tech and a whole field uh, rent with pa uh, patents just open up for many so I'd say yes yeah oh huh. I mean the BTC is literally a conglomerate built upon uh, patents and trademarks I could see how I just made a weird noise I don't know there is one weird case though yeah hmm I already told you what that place was. It's driving me crazy. You said you were gonna move it after. There you go. I can't reach it. There's this guy named Jack now. He's been the captain of very unique Blitzkrieg Corps unit. Yeah. Unique. The guy has had a really small unit. Five people, including himself. Yeah. The aesthetic of his unit's armor was heavily modded to the point that they looked like a, a squad of uh, Henshin heroes. Yeah. And what? I got tired of seeing the uh, the uh. There we go. <clears throat> they looked really gaudy, yeah. But it turned out th that the guy actually broke through uh, broke through the software and disabled the remote switch, Nia. He has one of the few, if not the only, suits in, uh, of armor with the OS intact, Nia. To say they're among the most wanted people would be an understatement, yeah. You know a lot about this. It's interesting, and yeah, the amount of things you hear when uh, dealing with drunk people of all kinds in the same place, and yeah. It also helps to put uh, put on a front that makes people lower their guard, yeah. And that should be familiar to you. True. I just realized that she has a shoulder cut off. Yeah, she's wearing sleep gloves. Turn this up for? No. For some reason, my brain didn't associate that. Huh. Huh. Alrighty. Wait. Here's a freebie. A fun fact, Nya. Yeah. The failsafe was originally going to involve the armor blowing up and leaving no traces, Nya. But regulations and laws didn't allow that kind of technology near civilians, Nya. I guess even Zybatsu Corp, uh, Corp has its limits, huh? People love to, de uh, to demonize Zybatsu Corp, uh, Nya, because, let's face it, they're far from innocent, Nya. I mean, that guy Mishima, he's... kind of a dick, Nya. He's all concerned about his hairline or something. Throwing children off cliffs and telling them to climb back up, Nya. Occasionally he disappears and then comes back, and nobody knows why, Nya. Are you okay? Yes. What what are you What are you referring to? Tekken. Oh. Also, Passion, do you play Animal Crossing? They're not evil overlords, yeah. They're just greedy. They're just a big corporation, yeah. They just so happen to have control over what tantamounts to a city, uh, to a city state, yeah. But corporations will naturally uh, resort to draconian methods, yeah. Oh. So I've heard horror stories from people outside the city trying to uh, use product placement, yeah. Ah. If you so much as hold a bottle to the wrong way or get in the way of the logo, you'll be in for lots of trouble, yeah. But let's not start with theme parks or the like. Those are dystopians of their own, yeah. Then again, most of them deem uh, most of the demonization is due to Kinsey being such a clown. He has no power anyways, yeah. He's just a front to uh front that whatever council uh, council behind Zabatsu Corp chose, yeah. He makes a fool of himself, and the intention is taken away from whatever it is that Zaibatsu Corp is actually doing, yeah. <sighs> yeah. So what were you saying is the Glitch City, uh, is that Glitch City is basically a huge theme park. I called the White Knights glorified mall security in the past, so yeah, nya. Huh.
No, seriously, hen what? <clears throat> Can I get a Brantini here, please? Yeah, sure, sure. Brantini! The, the reason I asked is because it looks like the only server that you and I share on Discord is the Animal Crossing server. And I didn't know you played Animal Crossing. And I play every single day. Six, nine, 10, 11, 12. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two. Aged and mix. Boop. Totally. Big old Brantini! Totally Not gonna deny it. Oh, oh, that's from there. Yeah, I'm still running. Here. Thanks, Nia. So I take it you're in a good mood today. Does it show, Nia? A bit. Yeah, well. I managed to nab a couple of th tickets for the Kira Miki Encore concert, Look yeah. Those ears. Oh my god. Her, her ears are actually sticking up. No, I see. Now. I see. She looks so excited. <laughs> oh, nice. And her mechanical eyes spinning a little faster than usual, too. You never noticed that? No, not really. <laughs> okay, Cat Boomer. All right, as it turns out, she was just here. Again, Nia? <laughs> <clears throat> Sorry, Nia. <laughs> Again? Can't believe I just missed her, Nia. I was surprised too. I was more surprised she remembered my name though. And like last time, she was quite the graceful client. Man, so, that's, so those rumors about her being really nice in person are actually true, Nia. Amazing. And the sharing can. Ooh. Okay? I mean, yeah, I'm fine. <sighs> I mean, you always want the famous people to be nice in real life, yeah. But having such backing to that claim, to hear that she's so nice to everyone, yeah. It's nice to hear, you know, yeah. In fact, many think that's what made her so famous so quickly, yeah. How she's down to earth and totally accessible, Nya, making her someone everyone wants to root for. Ah, I see. Yeah, I mean, I guess you you, know, you don't want to feel like you're supporting a crappy for supporting crappy people like Face Clan or anything like that. <laughs> Although to be honest, never put that much thought into that one. Hell, half the time I have no idea who made uh who made what I use, nor do I care much. Being a nice person will make you, f or will take you far, Nya. My daddy always insisted that being Riddler's was in the boardroom doesn't mean being an ass. Yeah. And he actually managed to get certain contracts over more, uh, over other more powerful people, Nya. All thanks to being a nice guy overall, Koopa. Uh. Sounds like a good. Did you just say Koopa? <laughs> Sounds like good advice. But more importantly, Daddy. <clears throat> yeah. You really believe me saying she was just here that easily? You're not the kind of lie about stuff like that, as uh, uh, so sure, yeah. Thanks, I guess. That said, can you go to the concert so easily? What, uh, what about, or what about security and the like? My dad always has a unit keeping an eye on me from a distance, yeah. And you'd be surprised how easily I can disguise myself with just a different hairdo and a cap, yeah. I see. I wonder if I can get in the disabled line with, uh, with Say in her wounds, yeah. Although she'll probably nag me about how she doesn't need it and we should we shouldn't abuse that, yeah. Say has a good head on her head, shoulders. Hey, can you get me a classic drink? I think yeah. Piano Woman's the classic drink. Uh, uh sure. Something classic. A type. Clean oh, no. Jane, beer, or frothy water. 
What's wrong? Uh, let's see. Bleeding Jane is at 200. Up. Oh, Nexus, what's up? <laughs> Go ahead. Yep, he stopped just so, just in case. I need that. Uh, would you, give me a moment here. I am going to do a quick be right back. Uh, but yes, I do want to do a, a secret character for this. So be right back right quick. Okay, I, yeah, the, there's, they sent me the documentation. Okay, I am back. Uh, Alana Cat is stepping away real quick. Uh, oh, I was supposed to say, did the game stop? Okay, so, Nexus. What's the plan? All right, uh, sure. So what's the thing for Flaming Moai again? Bronson, two powders. Oh, stop. Three flanners. Five karma trains. One, two, three, four, five. Mix. Stop. And reset. One, two, gonna serve a big bear! Stop. Sir. There you go. Thank you, Nia. Uh, a, a big beer, but uh, there's a secret client that will be popping up at some point with the Flaming Walleye that uh, was made, reset, and then served a beer. about this about what yeah say um told me about your eye that oh yeah i knew nya you did say told me nya it's uh i'm all right don't worry 
Still, that was quite the, um... I mean... Fuck. We all have our own share of painful stories, yeah. I might just be... I might just... Uh, yeah, I might be just as shocked hearing uh, something from you, yeah. I've gotten over it, but every time someone brings it, uh, brings attention to my eye, yeah, it starts hurting. The tech in the replacement is good enough, but remembering it hurts. Uh, remembering it hurts a bit, yeah. The phantom pain. Oh, still, yeah. She also told you about that Virgilio guy, didn't she, yeah? You know him? Virgilio Amandio. Uh, or didn't net any results after digging deeper. We found another name, yeah. Timothy Mercury, yeah. Branded traitor after killing a fellow white knight. Declared MIA. Yo! The, the fucking badass that, like... Oh, so he just fucking mer like took out a white knight for being a piece of shit this dude is fucking yo now d d again now I know why he's like yeah Sorry, okay. Gee, okay. hey, thanks. No, that's. I'm having trouble remembering story bits, but the reason that Say got hurt was from that building, right? Uh, from the bank, at uh, the attack at the bank. Yes. Okay. I thought maybe he was the one that attacked her because I'd forgotten about no. the attack. No. Uh, Virgilio is the one who attacked the guy who uh took Stella's eye. Oh. Yes. Seems like the guy knew how to hide himself, Nya. What are you gonna do? At the very least, seek him to thank him, Nya. It's the least I can do. Huh. Wait. Hmm? I just realized something's off with the whole tech gold rush story. What would it be, Nya? Wouldn't all that tech be patented anyways? I get trying to crack it in the first place, but... That would be true if the tech was patented in the first place, Nya. It isn't? Zabatsu had been so paranoid about making white knights untouchable that they never patented anything, Nya. A patent would be in the database that someone could hack and retrieve from, uh, valuable info from, info from, Nya. Not to mention they would be using tech from other companies without any authorization, Nya. And no patent registry in their right mind would approve of that gl uh, global shutdown signal, yeah. They're gummy. I can't pour them. I took a uh, couple. That's fine. They're Fucker? not the duos, though. They're just regular. That's, That's why I said I can't pour them. They won't come out. Let alone how it immobilized everyone still inside one of those suits, Nya. Yeah. So the ones that were upholding the law didn't uh, did so using suits that are that are by all means illegal. The irony runs deep, Nya, yeah, wouldn't you say? Why do it though? When you have so much uh, money, you start thinking uh, you can screw around with the rules, Nya. Yeah. All that power makes you think you're above every law there is, Nya. Yeah. yeah, that's true. One moment. In this city is what happens when, the, when those with money start making the rules. I'm curious though, have you ever covered up any fuck ups by using money? There's probably uh, hints that the game gives on how to make it at some point. Like you have to do certain conditions or something. Like you just stumble across it.
I think we've all done things we're not uh, too proud of at some point, yeah? In our lives. Well, Jill, gotta go, Nia. Anyways, a uh, pleasure. Ah, oh, please come again. <gasps> what the? That's another character from us, uh, from random uh, re read only memories. She, she's got kind of fox here. Kind of. Not necessarily. That's something that will probably be explained when, uh. Oh, she's the secret character you just got. Yeah. Next. I don't even know how to voice this one, so I'm just gonna do whatever. Kind of make it kind of like deep and mysterious, maybe. Excuse me. Is this the Red Shiba Bar? I'm aware it's a female. I'm just voicing it. However, we're aware they're a female. Hello? Somebody fell for that one. Yeah, but we prefer to call it Valhalla. We're gonna get you. Let's try the sugar rush. Certainly. Shit rush! Two rattled lines! I don't know how to say that. Powder Delta! And some optional camera dream! All mixed. Boop. Sugar up. Sugar up. There you go. Thanks. You don't look like you're from around here, miss. Call me Jets. I'm from Neo San Francisco, actually. I came here to see the mega Christmas I hear so much about. I've always wondered why it's called Neo San Francisco. Isn't it just like Neo Tijuana or is it more like New Mexico? Wait, there's a New Mexico? Still, that's a good question. What tips you off that I'm uh, not from around here? In fact, you're a hybrid. Really? I thought Glitch City was the world's most, uh, the world's genetic engineering in Mecca. Every time I, you hear about a uh, breakthrough in genetic engineering, it's most it most likely came from here. That's that's true. That's all true. If you have the money, Glitch City has some awesome advances, but many of them are gated behind giant walls of cash. Like genetic modifications or pro, uh, prosthetics. Is it really that bad? Let's let's say I wanted a treatment to change my hair color to yellow and my eyes to amber. Simple stuff, two shots. But just for the hair, I need to save uh to save minimum wage paychecks for ten years. Not only that, insurers still refuse to cover genetic modifications, even the medical ones. Sounds like an American health insurance. Weird. I mean, nowadays genetic modifications are pretty common everywhere else. I don't understand much about it myself. I think the exorbitant uh, import fees levied by the city are deciding are, are a deciding factor in the whole pricing situation. Or maybe it has to do with how devalued our currency is, or maybe it's both those things and uh, the uh, both those things and then some. And I'll say, yeah, we live in a cyberpunk dystopia. Wow, cool samurai! I see. Do you, do you know what Passion's talking about? And they're just agreeing with the cyberpunk dystopia thing. Yeah, but what's a co- That's more emote thing. Anytime you see like uh, weird strings of text like that, it's just a, an emote that doesn't isn't pros by, processed by Twitch itself. Oh, that's that's weird. Okay. Yeah, that's just how it is. I see it over here, but you, you oh. would, you don't. Okay. And if I pull that out from there, it's gonna pull it off from. That's fine. OBS. I mean, I could just grab it and just put it right here. It's, but it's fine. Yeah. Not important. Oh, but look at me rambling. I can get. Uh, can I get you anything else?
Hmm, let's try the Brantini. Oh, sure. Brantini! Cyberpunk dystopia always feels like repeating myself. Like a... Oh. Yeah, no, it, it does feel like a redundancy at this point. It's like something you would uh, hear from the Department of Redundancy Department. No, you... The reason it's confusing for me is because the Two, uh, on three, the chat that I'm four, looking at it doesn't five, have six, the Twitch emotes one, two, so three, it shows the two, words the emotes are named and, it, and I was like what? not your fault and mixed. oh it was a mix glad I stopped it on time damn Brantini here thanks it's interesting though. Hybrids are well received around here. And it has something to do with hybrids usually having lots of money. I guess it could be an example of higher class establishments, or uh, higher classes establishing beauty standards or something. It will make me more like uh, a more likely target for mugging then. Everyone is likely a target for mugging, and you just stick out a bit more than the rest. You do well to remain, uh, to remain vigilant anyways. Thanks for the advice. Hey, mind if I ask you some- or ask something? Go ahead. No problem. Are cat boomers hybrids? Huh. No, I don't think so. Well, there is a genetic- or there is genetic modification going on. It's more akin to being born with six fingers. The side effects of a treatment, if you will. We're- Really? Because there seems to be countries where cat boomers are considered hybrids. True, but think about it for a sec. Let's say you got a treatment from, uh, for a skin condition and the side effect was getting scaly skin. There's hybrids with, uh, with scales of skin, but your skin is a side effect. The scales might just be dead skin. Even if legally the scaly skin could make you a hybrid, you're not one necessarily. To lesser people. <laughs> Even if it's a law, laws can be wrong too. Yeah, the the on-screen chat, due to how uh, stream elements works, it automatically parses the emotes, so you can see them, but it's mainly just there. That makes sense. No big deal. Like, I could get the extension, and I probably will at some point, but I'm not too keen on adding more extensions to an already bloated browser. <sighs> yeah, you're right. Sorry about that. Uh, sorry about asking so many que uh, things. Oh, I don't mind. I guess you really don't see many hybrids around, huh? Oh, right. Could you give me directions to the uh, Artemis Will Mall? Uh, sure. Let me grab a piece of paper. Let's see... No, that doesn't come through. Just... No, because that's loud as fuck. <laughs> I can no longer hear what that was supposed to be. No. It's a fart with reverb. Oh. Turn right when you see a frat house. Here you are. Ah, thanks a lot. So do I. Goodbye. Please come again. All done. I am. What about you, Gil? For some reason, the other girl left him like that, it seems. Yeah, no, it really is. You think? Might be a while. Uh, uh, might uh, might have been while he was out. Huh? True. Hey boss, you're a fan of wrestling, aren't you? I mean, you were wrestlers, so... That I am! Why? I was wondering, isn't wrestling fake? Yes and no. That depends. Aren't twin tails for little girls and, and teens with 8th grade syndrome? Something echoing? Fart with reverb is way funnier to me. Oh, the it's the echoing. Durr. 
What's that echo? Eighth grade, what? When you get down to it, wrestling is, is a, as real as a soap opera. Yeah. I mean, you don't really expect legal lawsuit to be, uh, yeah, a legal lawsuit to be fixed in a ring, right? Sure, in my ideal world, you would solve, le solve legal problems through good old wrestling, but... <clears throat> no, seriously, 8th grade what? Genebio, you know. You don't go around call calling soap operas fake. The show, it just happens to uh, use fighters as an expression. Might as well see it as, as an, a unique form of theater. Besides, considering the injuries many wrestlers suffer, it's not all fake. Huh. I didn't think about it like that, or think about it that way. We should change the TV for wrestlers. We're talking about it. Sadly, I won't stand for anyone bad-mouthing wrestling. So, now I have to go and break Gil's back while you, uh, to make you humble. Oh, wait, wait, what? Come here, fuckboy! Fuck boy! Fuck boy! God damn it, bit of passion. <laughs> On guard, fuck boy, I'm about to make you a pretzel. Eighth grade, what? You gonna make him a pretzel as he little. Total funds, I made the quota. He a little salty. Make a pretzel. Ha ha, ha, ha. Yeah. Really Like an adult. Have a very nice day. All right, so that's the second day. Second. Yeah, we did two days. Oh, right. Which we usually don't. Well, and it's six thirty, so we did another extra half an hour. Yeah. Yeah. See you. Oh yeah. <laughs> two days. We did it. We did a stream with two days. See, now I'm kind of curious what a room would look like if we failed to pay that. Just a bunch of boxes and a, and a, and a fit of depression. And a very angry floor. Uh, is it? Is this the last day in the game? For them to respond, they'll, they'll get to respond when they can. <laughs> Two more days. Okay. But this is the main charge. Unless there's a ultra surprise charge at the very end. So probably the other two days next stream. Yeah. Two days next stream. What? No charges. Nice. So we're good to go. Alrighty, so, and with that. With that. Square shit. Ham ham. Yeah, I can go ham with purchase. So I'm just gonna go, I'm just gonna go to the shop and just buy all the things. Like assorted cartridges, or a cute clay house, or a replica robot. Maybe I'm just gonna get the- Meet the staff. The staff. This one's a scrap of paper with the download code for meet the staff. Hey. Maybe I should get another Kiramiki banner or a paper lantern or a PC-98. That's what I was talking about with the PC-98. Uh, that's an action. No, oh, it's not. There's a 9.5 and a 9.8. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, the 98 is the one that this game's color palette is um, more closely based on. Oh, okay. And uh, also, in turn, what our uh, art, what the artwork for the, this particular stream is based on, oh. it's the PC ninety eight uh, color palette, which is it's got a pretty decent color palette, but it's still a limited one compared to say uh, what we see today with Windows. So okay, above the the green sign on there, it's a white one and square. What does that say? Does it look English? I don't know, but you're not talking into the microphone. Sorry. I can't read what's in that white square, so... Uh... 
Victoria Freya Poor and Cargo. Huh. Nerd. I just like technology. I'm just gonna be real. So me knowing this shit should not be any surprise. Anyways, since that was our second day, we're gonna double that bitch down on the save button. Mm -hmm. Already saved. Okay, so the fun thing, what's going on with that? Before we do clo uh, conclude our screen, uh, stream. Oh! Oh, and that little sign means cold cakes made to order. Okay. Huh. I'll take a pan and fry a doodle. Never mind. It's a Disney reference. I keep forgetting that I'm probably only oh! binge is Disney. It's a schmuck. Okay, I might actually do... It's a big maybe on that one. Me do a stream of that then. Do the little mini games thing. But yeah. And with that... Uh, but yeah, and with that, I'm going to call it here because we did do our two days and this was a pretty big stream. Thank you for showing up. But yeah, uh, as per usual, I'll be running an advertisement for the maximum allowed time. It is not required, but it's greatly appreciated if you do stick around because it does give us pennies to the stream. And it helps uh, support the stream even if it is a, a little bit. It, it does. Square sheet. Like that, that, those few cents can bump it over to a paycheck. But if you feel like I earned your subscription, feel free to toss one my way. It'll be greatly appreciated, but don't if you don't have the money to do it. Especially if you have an Amazon one floating around there. Also, if you have, yeah, if you have an Amazon Twitch Prime, feel free to to uh, feel free to toss your one subscription my way if you feel that I earned your subscription. Because the more, that I, the more subscriptions I get, the bigger the paychecks will be, and the more, uh, sooner I can make this a full-time thing. On top of you. Oh, no. The moment I start making income off of this, I'm going to start asking for less and less hours over time. <laughs> but anyways. Yes. Square sheep is thick sheep. Gonna be running that ad. If you don't stick around, that's fine. But it's greatly appreciated that you show up to the, uh, to the stream, be it lurk or just talking, any, either which way. Because again, as I said before, it helps please the algorithm gods. Like, y'all have no clue how important even just saying hello and then nothing else else for the rest of the stream how much that puts me a little bit higher on the discovery ranking like that that bumps me more and more each time because twitch twitch and google by extension does care about interactivities uh statistics that's why a lot of streamers when they're really small like well smaller than even me also milking small bitties you know what they're not small it Thank counts. you for the 100 bits! 100 corgi bits. Corgi bits. But yeah, uh, inter interaction does help boost uh, exposure, and a lot a lot of the smaller streamers tend to not realize this. And while I'm I'm personally a small stream streamer myself, that's still like, yeah, but yeah, interaction. No matter what, talking, popping in saying hello you don't have to say hello but it does help just existing on my stream does help support the stream itself just existing helps us yeah hey, thank you for existing and we appreciate you even if you're just lurking we appreciate you for saying anything and yeah they already used the twitch prime sub there uh that was a uh, also corgo is ago. best doge but yeah as per usual gonna run the ads if you don't stick around that's cool uh thank you for watching have a good night and stay true to yourselves running.
I'm trying to get the audio going. It won't do it. Okay, yeah, it won't do it. All right, well, there went that joke. Was the ad done? Is the ad done? Oh, 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 there it is. Okay, so, and yeah, I, well, it didn't say it was done over here because the buttons were all grayed out. So I usually wait for that to be done. Oh, well, your dose sounds adorable. And you know what? what all of that stuff is when you're not feeling sleepy and whatnot. It's totally on you. I just, you know, wanted to let you know that I had sent you a DM in case, you know, you were on at some point. Whenever. Yeah. But yes! And with that, thank you all those who stuck around through the advertisements. We're going to be calling it here. Tomorrow will be some Final Fantasy fourteen, which I will actually... Real quick, show some of that off on the stream frame if y'all want to see that real quick. Because I can't set that over real, uh, over there real quick. What? So, the stream frame, for those who uh, may not be here to see that. Oh, night night. Is going to be looking like this. So, see y'all about tomorrow for some Final Fantasy XIV mount grinding. Anyways, have a good night, everybody, and stay true to yourselves. Oh, wrong button. There we go.